recap on the last episode. Uh, all of you had returned back to headquarters after a successful mission for the federal government. You were greeted with uh, absorbent amounts of money and cocaine and celebration. Hell. It was a little bit too bad that Agent Chamomile had decided to commit suicide, but you guys carried on having completed your mission. And um, Amara unveiled her new project of a side mission board for you, for you to do in your off time to make extra money. Uh, jumping on the opportunity, you all decided to grab um, Amara's list of people to fuck up, and you chose a uh, kind of decent-looking man by the name of Jimmy Talmer, <laughs> and you hunted him down to his rest uh, to the bar he worked at called the Big Eye, which was a bar primarily com um, made up of, of gingers. Uh, you proceeded to get Jimmy Talmer alone by himself, threaten him horribly. Uh, upon whence you learned that he was actually Amara's ex-husband and had won a Pomeranian named Mr. Fluffy in the divorce settlement. So after some more threatening, you were able to get to Jimmy Tolmer's house and grab the Pomeranian um, and head back to the headquarters, but not before punching him in the stomach. Now... Uh, you return that back to Amara, who was very happy, paid you in kind. Uh, and going back to the side mission board, you all were very interested in a personal request uh, by the famous streamer XX Lily Rose XX. Um, Bro, I, I was hoping XX would die out by this time page, but, or time. But, <laughs> what? Time page. Or time page. Time, this era. Um, page. Oh, you all guys also did a bunch of different shopping um, and bought various different items in the process. Um, kind of silent little. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> what just happened? I feel like, I feel like I cut out. So, uh, with that all resolved. It is now Wednesday morning, uh, April. Ugh, I don't know, April sixteenth, a Wednesday, uh, bright and early morning. It is yeah Wednesday, and you find yourselves at the usual Griffin headquarters in the lounge there, having. Taken the personal request from XX Lily Rose XX. What a name. Um, she descendant of XX. Alright, never mind. Oh. <laughs> hmm. So, so, are we starting here? Yeah, so you currently have the three of you. Um, in the headquarters, Jack Deacon has uh, had to leave after the last kerfuffle. His board of directors has quite a um, bevy of questions for him. Considering the fact that Amara has offered you your next job, which is to attend the Life Co. Um, tech reveal happening later this week. Right. She basically told you all that uh, Jack Deacon and the rest of you would be going in as like a corporate agent and their bodyguards, uh, as she had obtained a um, credentials under the name of a man called Bryce Davis that had, she received from Earl Grey. Uh, but for now, all three of you are in the Griffin headquarters lounge, um, chilling out, hanging out. Mr. Fluffy the Pomeranian is there, doing his thing. Oh yeah. Uh, Sweet dinner. And, um, yeah, at this point, you know, unless they had otherwise, you guys have picked up the job from Lily Rose and are kind of waiting to hear back from her. Um, you know Lily Rose to be a pretty influential Twitch streamer. 
Um, she does a shtick where she does Goddamn, twenty-four in the in the just chatting section. Yeah, uh, she does twenty-four-seven streaming, which basically means she streams her entire life, every aspect of her life, um, for people's views. Nice. Already, can you guys hear me? All right. I feel like yeah, I can hear you. No. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure. Uh, that's definitely an e girl right there. Yep. Yes, sir. So if you all have anything you want to do before um, your appointment with Lily Rose, no, no. I would suggest you do so. Do these side gonna... missions allow us to use company, like, products? Depends on the side mission. Okay. Um, I was going to throw the, uh, the cloaking device on my rifle. Yeah, so you spent some time doing that um, over the weekend. Go ahead and give me a basic tech roll. Uh, it's going to be DC... Uh, fuck, where's the DC thing? Damn, this is Lily. God damn. Uh, it's going to be DC 13. It's next to the Marvel thing. Okay. Oh, that was loud. Yeah. Yeah, so you took some time over the weekend, and you go mm. ahead and um, basically wired that device into your sniper rifle it's pretty well integrated in there now and for like a single action you can cloak and uncloak the um the sniper rifle nice my boy full dick Getting can't shoot it while it's cloaked though yeah of course <laughs> but at least let's me be a sneak wow gee you guys, i can't believe you you guys see voldek walk into the room holding apparently nothing before dropping that nothing on the coffee table where it makes a loud bang Look at this, mm -hmm. motherfuckers! I'm smart as shit. What? What sorcery is this? Um, actually, I'm a wizard. <laughs> Y'all <laughs> thought this was cyberpunk, but I'm just imagining. Oh, oh nice. Wow, I wasn't informed. Yeah. I read that. No, actually, so I take off, or not take it off, but like, I turn off the cloaking device and my rifle appears. I'm like, now it can be extra sneaky, boys. So, bada bing, bada boom. What are you gonna do with that guitar case, then? I don't know. <laughs> Put an actual guitar <laughs> in it. <laughs> yeah. Fucking nothing. You could probably get your money back for it. Yeah, if we ever it need, to, if we ever need to like chop somebody up, we could throw them in there. True. That's definitely an option. Or if you guys needed to put something in there, you could. True. Cool, cool. So, uh... What is the... My notes of things because I got like a silent. Oh. Um, so we're waiting to hear back from Lily, Lily Rose. Like, are we supposed to go to her or are we just supposed to wait for her to contact us? Uh, you basically reached out to her, taking telling her that you'll pick up the job. So for now, you're just kind of waiting for her to, to come by. Oh, okay, what is she coming? Thought we were going to see her. Cool, cool, cool. I pull up her stream. You know, might as well get some extra background learning. Yeah, you pull up her 24-7 her stream, and you can see, like, right now, she's walking kind of just down the street. She's absolutely surrounded by these uh, Twitch brand drones. Oh. Four, four or five of them that just kind of get different angles at any given time. Um, oh. But you can see that she's dressed, like, here in the picture. In, That's in my a, type of girl. Kind she of a small girl. Yeah, dressed in kind of like a smaller yellow bikini. Um, hey. Just walking, you know. What's up, world? It's your girl Lily Rose here going over to investigate the PMC Griffin Corporation. Hopefully we'll see some good guys. If chat wants it, maybe I'll fuck one of them. We'll see what happens. Camera head, oh, that's like you. <laughs> yeah. I like this stream. That's my type of girl. Oh, my God. Got a deep um, voice. Fuck. <laughs> she could probably beat me up. Hell. <laughs> uh, she looks rugged. Look at those tattoos, bro. She continues I'm, talking. Um, you know, bringing up certain things about what she's done. You know, day 15, constant streaming. Haven't been unconscious since then. We got this chat. We got this. Uh, go ahead and upgrade yourself to Prime if you want to get in on bathroom time later this day. Oh, shit. 
Dear lord. Give it up for day 15. <laughs> Yo, pin that. <laughs> Alright, you pinned it. Good. Um, eventually, after you guys kind of watch the stream for a while, you do see she, she walks up to the uh, Griffin PMC headquarter door, you know, your office. And she's like, alright, well, here we are, chat, you know. Hopefully we don't get shot in the face right away. How about that, huh? And she rings the doorbell. Hey, she's here. All right. Hey, right, Cameron, it's your time. Answer yeah. the door. Throw the phone sign. I, uh, I, slick, I slick my hair back, put the grease, you know. I'll let you handle this one, Cameron. All righty. So I go open the door. You open the door, oh, yeah. you see... Yeah, you see, you see the woman there, you know, dressed very scantily in, in that yellow bikini. Um... Big smile on her face, you know. Her eyes are, are wide open as it looks like she hasn't slept for for weeks now. Um, but yeah, she 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 greets you with a smile. Hi, I'm Lily Rose. Uh, is this Griffin Corporation? You've come to the right place. I uh I like a girl who doesn't value her sleep schedule. Come right this way. I uh I show her to the the room. Fantastic. Uh, yeah, as she walks inside and you get a closer look at her, she does look like she's had some some modifications done. Um, you see one of her, her eyes, clearly robotic, has like blue text streaming over it at any given second. This looks like she has some sort of chat replay built in. Um, well, thank you for having me. You know, it's always good to come by, you know? Of course. Anytime. I could uh, show you to my place later if you like this kind of place. Ooh. All right, Chad, don't forget to subscribe to Premium if you want to get in on Sexy Times later today. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, All right, God. fantastic. So so what's these troubles you got for us, Rose? Sorry, XX, Lily Rose, XX. <laughs> yeah, so you, you, you lead her to the, to the lounge, you know, and she still has, like, four drones that are just kind of hovering in and around, I'd, so it's, pre it's pretty loud. <laughs> I would, uh, I'd prefer if there wasn't drones chilling, recording our faces. You know, unfortunately, that's just part of the contract I signed. So, <laughs> nothing to do about it. I have oh. to capture every angle for 24-7 viewing, you know, every angle, every good angle. And it's she gestures to the one... Like, permanently viewed on her ass. Yeah, you, you, she points <laughs> over to the one that's basically always staring at her tits. Nice, nice, nice. Um, you do see all the drones have, like, the Twitch logo on them. Damn, even in the future, Twitch is strong. Man, just chatting's too powerful in the future. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm calling for a little bit of a personal trouble. You know, somebody like me, always out there, you know, I attract a lot of crazies. A lot of people, mm -hmm. you know, don't like what we do here, chat. Thank you for the 50 subs, Pikachu. Now <laughs> then. And she go ahead and she, she pulls out a, a piece of paper out of her cleavage and kind of puts it on the coffee table. Um, oh. now, I don't know if what I can say can necessarily go, you know, on air. Um, but go ahead and, and look at that request, and uh, you know, I'll be in touch. So, so oh, and uh, Kramerhead grabs it with his foot. <clears throat> what? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Wait, did he Voldek <laughs> grabbed it with his foot? Yeah. Voldek hmm. reaches across the table and grabs the piece of paper with his foot and is reading it, one foot on the coffee table and one foot in front of his face with the paper. Okay. God flexibility. <laughs> Alright. Wait, what was what was Lily about to say to Camerahead? Uh, well, well, your co-workers reading that, uh, chat thinks that we should go have a quickie in the bathroom, so how about it? Alright, sounds good to me. Sounds Fantastic. good to me. Uh, she, she pushes like a button on the side of her head and the the lights on her face kind of changed color a little bit. All right, switching into to premium view over here. All right, everybody with me. Um, and it just kind of makes a beeline for the, for the closest other room, basically. Are you going to follow her? Of course, as long as okay. she doesn't murder me. There, all right, so so you, her, and like five cameras all go into the next room. Yes. Don't worry, I'm recording as well for my professional records. Um, so Shift and Voldeck, you guys remain in the lounge 
um, with that piece of paper that she l- set down. Hold it. Uh, what does that say? I also don't want to touch that. <laughs> so I was making background news. Um, so like, <laughs> what is that? <laughs> <laughs> I was just making background noise. <laughs> Yo, I'm about to age restrict this video. <laughs> oh, um, hold on. What, what does the piece? What does the paper say? Yeah, you read the paper. It's a pretty. It's a pretty well uh, drawn out note. Um, you know, scrawled in, in pen. It looks like the handwriting of somebody who hasn't slept in 15 days. Um, but basically says, you know, help. Please help. help. Yes, help. I need to stage my own death. Please help me escape this fucking hell. Oh, shit. Uh, I'm... Shift, I I, I think this is Lily's handwriting. I think she wants us to... I think she's putting a hit on herself. I, uh, like... Check the the barrel, my gun. Well, we can do that. Okay, but hold up, hold up. She, I don't know if it's necessarily a hit, but I think it's definitely like a help. I want to get out of this life, and so we could definitely just like disconnect her from the streaming and all that. I mean, we have to make it look like it's some sort of accident without getting us uh, us involved. Yeah, yeah. yeah we would don't have... want a Griffin Corporation to be responsible for the death of a famous streamer. Uh, hmm. I, I mean, mean, the thing is, if we help her stage it, it might look the company look bad due to the fact that everyone else will like assume that we failed in our job to protect her so it might be better for our own interests to publicly look like we don't accept the job but actually accept it and go through with the contract but then how do we get paid well no we confirm with her secretly or however we like to how can we do that i don't know uh we might I have mean, to... she somehow wrote that piece of paper without the other people on stream knowing, right? Or That's she... true. It's true. We could we could write back onto the piece of paper somehow. Uh... Yeah, we should. Okay, let's write. We accept the job, but are concerned. And I grab my other foot, and I'm writing this on the piece of paper. <laughs> God damn. Well, we can we can proofread it first. Shift is pretty impressed that oh. you're writing with your feet. <laughs> it's one of my this isn't something they put in the skill skill chart um but what we could write is you know we accept the job and we understand your pain however we need to keep griffin's image in a good lighting so public we were going to reject the job and then we would like to discuss in a private manner how to uh, go about this. Do you want death or do you want um, disconnection? And I put a little like. Well, no, she she wants to stage her death, so she obviously doesn't want to actually die. Gotcha, gotcha. We could use the stun bullets. Yeah, we could like we could you and me could simultaneously take down the drones. We could like take them out real quick, and then we have yeah. um, camera head shoot a like a. a electricity bolts at her knocking her out so it like mm-hmm. would zap fry all of the electronics or at least connection for temporarily right yeah yeah i don't really know oh. when she wakes up it might turn back on i don't exactly know how it would work i don't know either we might have to it would it would benefit having a software company guy right now but goddamn he's busy <laughs> yup <laughs> Definitely um, would. Um, trying to think. In, in the meantime, Walter, you're you're definitely enjoying yourself. Clapping. Um, you are. It's... 
<laughs> you are distracted, but it's the almost constant I, I'm commentary. I'm muting your fucking audio, Walter. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> it was very necessary. <laughs> uh, you, 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 you hear after after a few more seconds. Um, it quiets down a little bit, and then Lily Rose kind of walks back out of the the closet or the bathroom or whatever. You know, readjusting her bikini. The swarm yeah. of dress just kind of follows her. You guys don't understand. That was the best pussy ever. Some voluptuous. I've heard that compliment so many times. Thank you very much. <laughs> I throw Body count don't matter to me. Alright, so did you guys uh, did you guys figure out what, what, what her help was? What her problem was? Yeah, um I kind of like signaled the wool deck to to like fold up the paper and hand it back to her and be like yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to uh, take the job, but um, we wrote some advice there on that piece of paper, so please review it in uh, privacy just uh, for your own benefit. She, she glances at it before slipping it into into her bikini and gives you a wink. All right. All right, I can work with that. Well, you know, I'll see what's going on. You right. single later? Yeah. Wait, so we're not going to... We're not going to take the job, guys? No, I don't no, think we no. can take this one. Okay. Yeah, that seems a little out of our pay grade. Well, uh, I got what I wanted. Yeah, you got some splooged. I, I left my uh, phone number there on your ass cheek, so feel free to give me a call whenever you have the time, all right? Oh, oh shit. It. She was pegging him. <laughs> <laughs> Those were my moments. <laughs> Uh, she, she kind of winks at all of you before making a move for the door, and as she leaves out, she kind of reaches out a hand and gropes uh, Shift's ass as she, on her way out. Okay, Alright, chat, though. very successful time. Glad you all. Thank you for the 100 gift subs there. And yeah, she leaves. Shift's a little bit uncomfortable with that, but alright. She's for the streets. <laughs> she belongs to the streets. Um... So is she gone? Yeah, she's gone. Um, there she goes. I look over at Cadmerhead and be like, uh, yeah, that was all fake. We're taking the job. Um, I, I figured it's much. Y'all wouldn't just turn down free money. Um, but uh, it needs... We need a plan because she wants to stage her own death. Oh. That's... Should be easy enough. I mean, maybe. I think that. But with four drones and a constant stream of people, we're going to need to think of some way to make it look like she's dead and not involve Griffith. That is very true. But, like, are the drones connected to her life force or maybe just her consciousness in general? <laughs> her or... life force? I, I, don't, I don't think so. Uh, <laughs> this, ain't, this ain't like a boss health bar. <laughs> Cameron, as a, as a streamer yourself, go ahead and make me a knowledge vocal check. Alrighty. Oh wait, no, I'm not in character. I'm not trying to toothpick. Hold on. Oh, true. What are you doing? Okay. Alright, what, kind of, right, what kind of check? Uh, local expert. Local expert. Where is it? There it is. Damn, I can't wow. believe. So, Damn, so right? you, you, uh. You know the basis of, of 24-7 streamers. Um, you know, they're, they're folks that stream pretty much every single aspect of their daily life for monetization. Um, the way it usually works is they're underneath some sort of contract with a company, such as Twitch. Um, and the company w is the one that's basically controlling all the drones at any given time. Cool. Um, they're yeah. not necessarily connected to the streamer, um, but they are definitely always around the streamer based on the company contract. That is not the life to live, guys. I, uh, I like the freedom streaming when I want to. Hmm. Get behind that. I'm just like, I'm thinking really hard about how we can do this. Yeah, so, so like... Me and Shift were talking about how you can, are the only one who should be up close and personal, because obviously you've already been up in them guts. 
True, true, so true. Like, I suggest that we add some kind of stun discharge device to your penis <laughs> and <laughs> while in coitus you can activate it and have her become okay this sounds kind of rapey <laughs> yeah like yeah, this is like this, this ain't blade runner bro <laughs> yeah bro i'm not harrison for it oh yeah, my God. Tr- you're not going anywhere <laughs> <laughs> I'm locking you to the room until you fucking me. Well, I think one thing we could do, I mean, is we could pretend we're, like, in a sense, normal thugs. We would need to go get regular balaclavas instead of ones that have our logo on it. But True, we could... Have a it's not. Um, we could have it, like, you're sniping from a far-off location. I'm kind of at medium range so that my SMG isn't useless. But then we get a... <laughs> We get camera head here to give the the finishing blow on her, um, with the Owned. EMP or the what were the ERD weapons? EDR. Or EDR. There we go. The EDR weapon. Her. Knock her out. Something like that. Cool. All right. That's that's all cool and all, but like, what do we do about the drone? Well, no, that's what I'm thinking. Like, me and Voldek shoot the drones, and then you hit her. Oh, okay. There's four drones, so we're gonna have to quick. Yeah. I mean, I mean we could like shoot do we have like access to any like EMP weapons or anything that could like disable the drones? Well yeah, that's, that's what the EDRs are. Do we oh. have any do we have any like smoke nades or anything like that? We could disorient the drones, but I don't know what type of vision they have. Well putting like a smoke nade at her feet and having it explode would cover like obscure view. Then we take out the drones as fast as we can and then get rid of her. <laughs> oh, but you know what we need? We need to make sure she goes down on camera. Yeah, so they have no reason to follow her anymore. Mm-hmm. I don't know though, because like, what? I, I feel like she's probably pretty valuable to Twitch. So they probably come in like try to recover the body or something. Mm. Yes, but if she's just gone, we yeah, could he- have a. A kidnapping situation. Hmm. We could do that. Or we could leave like a scorch mark on the ground as we take her away. So they we think they think that we just incinerated her on spot. I mean, uh, obviously she's we could just like burn part of her clothing and like leave it there too. Yeah. <laughs> or we could just like invade Twitch and take it out. <laughs> just take out the, all of Twitch. <laughs> All of Twitch. <laughs> yeah, we gotta get rid of them just chatting people, right? <laughs> um, the mega corporation uh, must fall. Exactly. Um, oh, I'm just. Uh, well, it would be cool to storm Twitch. I do think that we're very underprepared for that. Yeah, you're probably right. <laughs> Maybe um, right. As a solo, do I know where they sell like? Blanks or anything like that. Blanks. Yeah. Yeah, you could ar- arguably get blanks from mules munitions if you wanted to. Oh, true. Because, because people might know what an EDR is, right? So they might know we just stunned her. It might we might need to show that we actually look like we kill her. Yeah. In a sense. True. Like, maybe make sure the camera's down to, like, one camera, and then it shows, like, one of us, like me, doing the finishing shot on her head with a blank. Uh, Don't do it too close. She could actually still die. uh, True, true, true. But you know what I mean. Like, enough so that it looks like a real bullet hit her in the head, not a... Right, right. A fake. Or we could just fucking kill her. (laughs) (laughs) I don't think we will get rewarded. Let's not do that, but, you know. Just murder some, bro. Just just think about it this way: if you help her with her contract, she'd be really grateful to you. That is true. She's already hit it. She's. I'm saying, I already got her number, bro. I got her number. She could be a weekly call. Yeah, she might even be useful. I'm just saying, if if you help her, it might be a daily call. You know what I'm saying? Oh, true, true. I don't know, man. My reserves are—they'd run pretty low, but <laughs> who knows? <laughs> 
Yeah, you All can always take stimulants for that. Oh, true. This is the future. But that makes <laughs> that makes your PP go down. <laughs> the time is now. The future is here. <laughs> <laughs> then an ad pops on for off everlasting, uh, <laughs> everlasting <laughs> bills. <laughs> <laughs> Everlasting boner. <laughs> <laughs> so like I know y'all aren't gonna get this, but like as soon as <laughs> as soon as you said like an ad starts, I thought of the like fucking the one piece like transition songs for like one of the characters. <laughs> and he's very energetic. When you said everlasting boner, I can see him saying that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll never watch why, one but... piece, it's trash. <laughs> this this old um, song, like beam song, I heard on tic not TikTok on Vine, came into my head where he's like, "When you're just trying to fuck, but you can't get it up, what you gonna do, Viagra?" Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um. And also, would would Mule's munition like have balaclavas or something like a face covering of some sort? They don't really tend to sell clothes um, all that much. What about the Gucci store? What, what about the just, Gucci like, store does sell balaclavas. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Alright. Hi, Tia. I would get a Gucci balaclava. I, I don't, I don't want to spend all my money on a balaclava. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> I'll fucking shoot you in the head, Baldick. Dude, try it. <laughs> you know, I'm, I, I'm really debating whether or not I should or is PvP you know, something we should... <laughs> anyway. um, alright so so how how are we going to do this we got sniper boy close up we're going to take out the drones and then or we should leave one uh, to record her getting shot and then have that one get taken all right, all right. Does that seem legit? Ooh. It, it, it sounds like it should work. Or not? Ooh. Um, Ooh. What we could do is to get her where we want, you could phone her, right? All right, yeah. I do and that. Then, and then, like, while she's approaching you, I come up behind and blast you in the back of the head with, like, a blank. And it looks like you've been killed or some shit. Okay. But then, and then the plan goes like the rest, like just shit goes, breaks loose, and then Voldick starts shooting the cameras. I start shooting at her or something like that. See, while that would work, I I'm do just, think that. Just to get her where we want to get her, but because otherwise I, we would have to act where she is, and it might be in like public, so. See, and then, I like yeah. the idea. However, I do believe that my public execution would also hurt my viewership. I mean, are you, but you're not right. recording 24-7, though. Well, yeah, true. But, I mean, people who watch our stream could also watch my streams. And that'll hurt. Fine. You, you could just Shit. make a, a stream be like, bro, I'm not dead, you know. Little <laughs> bit of order. Yeah, true, true, true. Dude, a comeback stream would get you a lot of views. Oh, yeah, true. Oh, I rise from the ashes. Dude, you could, you could take her viewership, be like, yo... <laughs> once once that goes viral, once her execution goes viral, be like, yo, that was me that got taken out first. Like You just got pranked. <laughs> you got pranked. Pranked. It's actually celebrity prank with Zach Efron. <laughs> Nephew Tommy comes up. <laughs> um Alright, I mean like, to start, I uh, mean, I guess I could head to Mule's Munition and get some gear. Maybe you guys can go get balaclavas, or one of you can go get them. At least as a start. Alrighty. Yeah. Um. I I do believe we should uh we should go with you, Mister. Uh, I have a car. Oh yeah, true. Um. <laughs> All right. I'm um, sure there's a place near Mia's munitions so we could get some clothes. Yeah. True. Yeah, man. I got a local expert. We can just pretend we're homeless people assaulting you. Get out of your money. Store. Oh, I'm going to leave a note that I died. I won't. I, I wasted won't. all my money on Gucci. I'm homeless now. <laughs> <laughs> Gucci. I got my Gucci ball club. 
I guess if we're all getting in my car, I'm going to head out. Uh, I guess we'll start driving towards uh, Mule's Munition. Okay, yeah, you guys um, head out. As you go ahead and you walk out the front door um, shift, you're greeted with a single Twitch drone that's just kind of hovering there about eye level. Um, I just whack it. Yeah, I was going to say. As you reach out to whack it, um, the moment you open the door, it kind of turns and flies up into the sky. I um, grab out my sniper rifle and try to shoot it. <laughs> yeah, I was, I was gonna say, a ship just shoots it with a gun. <laughs> uh, go yeah. ahead and make me a attack roll. I'm gonna need you to have um, head, the headshot modifier on. Alright, alright. All right. <laughs> hey, you better shoot that thing. I think it shift, knows our shift, entire plan. Shift, uh, shift, shift don't want that uh, ship recording him in general, even if it wasn't... Oh, uh, and the normal shit. DC for this is gonna go ahead... And be uh, oh, ten, 10 because it's 100 to 200 meters away. Nice. Oh, big dub. Nice, 25. Even with a critical fa failure, I still got it. Nice. Nice. Um, yeah, you go ahead and you, you take it down. Shift, are you also shooting? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, shooting, I'm shooting too. <laughs> okay, you both just pull out your guns and just annihilate the drone as it tries to fly away. Uh, it crashes into the other side of the street on the sidewalk. Um, this is a small fire. That? Do we want to go grab it? Uh, it could be useful. Uh, we definitely don't want it to recover and dip on us. I think it knows our whole plan. True. True. We'll walk over there and look at the wreckage. Uh, I mean, yeah, you see the, the busted-up drone. It looks like a duck that's been taken out with a shotgun. Is there anything recoverable from it, like, data-wise? Anything recoverable? Yeah. Um, go ahead and make me a basic tech check. I'll do I think I should do that. <laughs> oh, you're rolling before I can even get Oh, wait, 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 whoa, whoa. I have the, the minus six on I may have got the, the hit modifier. Yeah. Um... Yeah, twenty. I mean, you 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 kind of dig around inside of it. Um, you f you find like the the Bluetooth connector that's on it, as well as like the the camera backup. Jesus Christ! The music just like overpowered <laughs> everything that just <laughs> happened. The Bluetooth connector and, and One what do you say? While I get this fucking... Oh my I'm god! So sorry. I, I have I have its user volume very very low on my end, so I, I never account for how loud it's gonna be for anybody else. Does the yeah, it's just like, nowhere? Like, does the camera backup include audio? Um, I mean, you don't know. <laughs> you don't know. We should destroy that. Should we? Well, like you see the 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 like dull blue light of like a bluetooth adapter and start to like just kind of fade out it could give us like a some kind of clues as to how to handle this situation i really don't know what it could teach us at this point though yeah fair enough <laughs> <clears throat> since we're um, gonna take out the drones anyway do you want to just smash it yeah sounds good to me yeah let's just smash it yeah, we throw it on the pavement and start smashing it. Completely. Clean up the already destroyed drone even more. <laughs> uh, people walking on the sidewalk kind of look at you weirdly. Tech will not control connect. us. Little baby man. You're just beating it like that uh, that one animated thing from DC where like the Green Lantern just got his ass whooped by some random demons. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I duff, I uh, dust the electronic uh, parts off my coat and be like, "All right, do you wanna head out?" Yeah, that's cool. All right, I, I guess we had to mules munition. Yeah, you guys make it to mules munition. Um, you see, you see the man, the myth, the legend, mule inside his, his dirty ass shop is there. Um, um, I, look, I look at Voldek quickly before he enters. Like, keep an eye out for a drone. Be good. My boy mule. Oh, yeah, you see mules there. Pops, thanks uh, for the sword, bro. 
Uh, well, if it doesn't, uh... I never told about. you my name. <laughs> oh, and just, uh, how's it going? Pretty good. It's, it's, been, it's been less than uh, 48 hours, but what can I do for you? Well, we're looking for sir, some gear. Um, well, one, do you have any blanks? Like, do you carry blanks? Uh, blanks? Uh, I mean, we do, yes. Uh, how, how many do you need? Just a, a box? Or... Maybe, yeah, like enough for a couple of magazines for my SMG. Okay. Uh, he ruffles around in one of the cabinets underneath his workbench and, and pulls out like a dusty ass um, box <laughs> of blank rounds. Uh, 20 bucks. Sold. Um, and do you have anything potentially EMP related? Oh. EMP related, though. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh. He he goes over to kind of the the grenade section. No, I thought this guy around. was Russian, not Japanese, but I guess I was wrong. Um, <laughs> he comes back with a few different items and sets them on the table. Uh, I have these pistols uh, from the motherland. Wait, wait. Quite good. <laughs> And I have the EMP grenade too. Does does the job. How much for the grenade? A grenade? Uh, $50 per head. And what exactly, like, what's the radius of explosion? How effective are they? Um, let me check the custom rules. <laughs> let me check the normal rules. You know, just imagine being like an intern at Twitch, and you're like, "Oh yeah, I gotta watch these Griffin guys for the for the views," and then these guys walk out and just light up your drone. <laughs> <laughs> like fuck my oh. job! <laughs> I just uh, lost my job. You're fine. Uh, the radius here is three meters on mm -hmm. grenades okay. and explosives. Alrighty. Um, what is that in that regular uh, inch pools? I'll buy four grenades. Okay. So Thank you very much. 200 bucks, yeah? That's 200 eddies. 200 eddies. 200 eddies. My friend, you've done it again. Appreciate it. Okay, and anything for you two? Uh, I don't... I don't think so. Yeah, I think I'm okay. I'm on a money diet right now. Okay. Get out of my shop. Oh. <laughs> right, we got kicked up. As I'm leaving, I'll be like, after this job, I might be able to buy that assault rifle off you. I'm always oh. on the lookout for more swords. Okay, I'll put this behind the counter for you. Nice. Um, we'll set a better angle. I'm in. As we go outside, do we see any like drones or anything? Uh, make me a perception check. <laughs> Oh no! Don't so worry. don't worry. Minus hey, one. I mean, at three and eighteen. Don't worry. Dude, Jeff, do you see a fire away. hydrant? Oh shit! You see it. You see a very nice yellow fire hydrant. Uh, Voldek, you go ahead and you kind of with, with your with your targeting um, optic, you kind of scan the the sky really quickly. You know, focusing in on anything moving, um, and you do like kind of see what looks to be a drone, kind of well up into the um, probably like 10 stories up, just kind of floating through the air. Not necessarily focused on you guys, but just moving along. Do hmm. you want to check if that's Twitch related or not? Yeah. Twitch? Yeah, it's it's purple. It has the Twitch logo. Uh, do I shoot it? <laughs> let's, if you let's, want to. let's start driving and see if it follows us. So if you could keep yeah, an eye on it. Smart, smart. Do we need to like track it? Like, does anybody need to do a tracking roll or anything for that? Yeah, go ahead and make me a tracking check, Voldeck, to keep your eye on it. Oh, shit. Nice. nice. Yeah, that's plenty good enough, yeah. So you guys start driving um, and to right now the... And we're, we're driving aimlessly, actually, at the moment, just because I want to know if it's following us. Okay, go ahead and make me a driving check. Uh, 
Oh, well, 19. <laughs> Dude, why does... Uh, you you see a sh shift oh, runs like a pedestrian, a jaywalker off the road. Um, but otherwise, it's driving kind of fine. You guys go around for a bit. You, the, as you keep your eye on the Twitch drone, it doesn't seem to be following you people. It seems to just be kind of going on its um, straight line through the through the sky. Yeah, after this job, we have like a vendetta against Twitch and we just start shooting down their drones. <laughs> We're just, like, like, really sussed out. <laughs> um, I'm just chilling in the back seat. All right, yeah, I guess right. we start heading to, like, some some discount to, clothing to, store. Oh. Yeah, bro. Canada Goose. Yeah. I won't, oh, I won't make you... <laughs> I won't make you... Yo, there, that. There's about to be a goddamn fight. <laughs> I won't make you roll for that with your solo ability. Yeah. Um, you do know the name of a of a decent tailor's. Uh, there's a place called um, Travis's Threads. That's kind of downtown. Um, you know the owner. He's kind of like a preppy kind of asshole, um, but his place is is weirdly nice to be positioned just downtown, um, and it looks like a good store. All right, I guess that's where we had. So, okay. Um, yeah, you guys pull up outside of Travis's threads. Um, it's a very kind of nice, elegant, black and, and neon green storefronts um, with kind of wide windows that have um, mannequins in them wearing different kind of cyberpunky outfits. Well, I didn't even see this freaking balaclava you posted. What is this, Tom? It's a Gucci balaclava. <laughs> oh, it's a Gucci balaclava. All right, all right. Wait, is it really? Let's see. <laughs> we're not, really we're not getting the Canada Gooses, bro. Is that real? Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> Why did they make that? I like the Gucci in there, Loki. <laughs> yeah, Loki, it's, it's sick. Do they have Gucci in the store? There are nope. Gucci stores, uh, whether or not this one has it. You guys go ahead and you, you walk in. Um, you see the store is pretty empty except for, oh, for looks like a guy guy looking at a suit. Um, and you see this man here, you he know, behind like the counter. I'm about what he's I do not like about. Huh? I don't like this guy. I said I'm about what he's wearing, though. Yeah, true. I like his outfit. I don't like him. Though. Yeah, he raises his eyebrows as he sees the three of you walk in. Uh, uh, welcome to Travis's Threads. Can I help you? Are you Travis? Yes. Oh, okay. You look hey, like a Travis. Travis. Threads. Okay, well, you look like a... Don't say it. I like a what? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, cool. Uh, so we're looking for uh, face hidey things. Face heady things, huh? What do you call them? Going hiking. Power Yeah. Going hiking in the mountains. Yeah. mountains. We want some warm things. Yeah, do you have bro, anything stylish that would cover our faces? Stylish? Uh, he kind of looks you all up and down. Um, Shut up, we have money. <laughs> yeah, so what's your price range? If I may ask. What's your price range? Probably higher than yours. Can I? Can I do a? Uh, Nothing do too a... expensive, but we're not poor. If that's what you're implying. I mean, I'm wearing a I bitch and bomber jacket, bro. <laughs> you want Gucci or you want like some weird lower class stuff? How much is Gucci? Gucci, eight hundred dollars. Fuck. How much is the lower class stuff? <laughs> uh, I don't know, 15 if it's just a balaclava, I guess. Can I roll stealth to steal the, the Gucci one? Uh, you can see all the Gucci stuff is in a glass case behind him. But if oh. you want to roll stealth for it, go ahead. <laughs> is, 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 like, Camerahead about to shoot up this guy? <laughs> no. If I failed, then I'm just gonna pretend like I was, a uh, like I tripped. Of course. I need you to tell me what you're trying to do with the uh, key. Why don't you tell me what you attempt to do, and I'll, I'll modify it as I see fit. Oh, I'm I'm attempting to uh, phase my hand through this glass 
and steal this fucking balaclava. Uh, so you reach over the counter towards the balaclava, and Travis kind of stands there and watches as your hand just kind of touches the glass. <laughs> I want it. <laughs> um, I, 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 I'm afraid I'm going to have to ask you to stand on the other side of the counter, sir. I pull a oh, yeah, camera head true, back. True. And like, real story. My bad. Behave, camera head. We're in public. <laughs> you do see the other, the one other like corporate guy in here is kind of looking at the commotion. You got a problem, bro? Oh, hello there. <laughs> Does a face down? <laughs> yeah, are you sure to do a face down? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm gonna do a face down against this corporate guy when I say you got a problem. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, <we're> uh, joking. <laughs> Let me pull up his character sheet. <laughs> he has like ten times the reputation anybody ever has. <laughs> yeah. Let's see, watch. I've already got two critical fares in a row. Let's do it. Yeah, true. He's like, actually, I own Twitch. Twenty. Uh, hey, Actions. Uh, face down. Yeah, fuck you. Hey. Bitch. Hey. If there's one thing shift always does, it's win face downs. Uh, I mean, you you see that he 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 just kind of turns around and he immediately goes back to staring at those suits, stiff as a board, um, as he was before. Yo, he's a Twitch mod. What is this? Oh uh, no, he's not a Twitch mod. I accidentally had the wrong. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he was oh, about, no. I was about to shoot this guy. <laughs> oh no! He go, he goes back to staring at thread counts. Um, as as Travis just kind of looks at what you've just done and is like, I did you come in here to intimidate my customers, bro? He was, Are you even customers? Yeah, Your we're customer. we're gonna buy some cheap balaclavas from you. He, he was looking at me funny, bro. What am I saying? Okay, bro? I'm looking at you funny. What are you gonna do? Threaten me? I mean, if you got a Based problem. Down. If we really got a problem, it's fine. I didn't didn't... shadow roll. I I know. No, that was a bad face down. (laughs) That was a bad face down. No. No. Jeez, hold on a second. (laughs) You're still going to win it. Don't worry. I believe in you. Yeah, let's hope so. <laughs> you oh, and he he blue eyes eyes dragon, and he's got blue eyes ultimate dragon. So like, <laughs> you're gonna lose the face down. He just pops the hell out of you, right quick. I'm pretty sure I have the faster reaction time. Yeah, but you got a negative three, bro. Probably still faster reaction time. I really doubt this guy's owner. This guy, like a tailor, has faster reaction time than, than me, <laughs> even with a minus three. One shot, you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is like the final boss. Yeah, he's the actual Twitch mod. He's here in disguise. <laughs> he actually just suffocates you with a balaclava. <laughs> you know, the main thing is, I bet you this guy has a pretty high reputation, though. Uh, maybe he seems like a dick, but like he probably seems like somebody who doesn't actually. Nobody actually likes him, but he's well known. He's like um, he's like Flash from uh the the Spider Man movies. Uh, yeah, it looks like Travis just kind of as you as you threaten Travis, uh, he just kind of stares at you with his very fashionable face, and it kind of dawns on you how you're trying to intimidate a man within his own shop and how much that's not going to work. <laughs> so. As per the rules of face down, you can either back down or take a minus three to all the rest of your checks against him. I'll take a minus three. How about we let camera head do the talking? Anyway, right, guys, well, let's, uh, just, let's just buy the Pelicovas and leave, bro. Yeah, let's, just buy the, the, let's just buy these things and get out of here. I think I'd like an apology. Oh. Hey, man. I'm just going to be we, like, I'll leave, leave, I'll leave. Or we could just buy things from you, and we'll be out of your hair. Your but real man is pretty presumptuous. You you walked in here and intimidated both my customers and me, or at oh. least attempted to. There's a bargain bin on the other side of the room if you want to look for balaclavas. Hey, thanks, Doug. 
start walking towards the bin. Yeah, you see there's, I mean, there's some, there's like, basically thrift store supplies, and there's balaclavas in there. Okay. With like, and there's like gloves that only has like one glove. <laughs> My favorite, I love those. Are we I, 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 I buy a singular glove. We're yeah, you come back with your with your three ball clubs and one glove. Uh, it'll just be thirty five for the whole bunch. I cool. I wait for like everything. Is, are are we paying this as like a group? How many eddies per person, or is it thirty five per person? Thirty five for for everything you have here. Oh, I didn't try and bargain. I mean, it's thirty five bucks, bro. <laughs> Can you spot me? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Yeah, I got you. I'll Venmo you. Hey, you real? I guess I'm sorry. How much? How much are you we putting this? You. It's, it's literally just thirty-five. <laughs> I'll, 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 I'll handle it. All right. Plops you you hand him. Yeah, you handed the thirty-five Eddies. Thank you. Uh, Any time. With your douchey face. Now let's get out of here, please. Okay. Okay, now. Flip out. Get the fuck out of my store. <laughs> I yeah, think we, we won't really, be back. We burned bridges at that shop. Like... Yeah, and you better <laughs> give me a refund when I'm done using this thing. True. Like, I just imagine, like, we start trying to run away, and it does that, like, Scooby-Doo sound effect, where it's like... <laughs> <laughs> So, you know, like, at the end of this campaign, when we have, like, ten reputation, we just have to come back here and shoot up his shop, and then be like, bro, you ain't even up. <laughs> you, you're nobody to us. Yeah, what's the what's the name of this shop? Travis's, uh, Travis's Threads. Threads. Yeah. What is it? Travis what? Travis's Threads. Travis's Threads. Travis's Threads. Travis's Threads. No, right, Threads. Got a note Threads. 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 Right. Threads. I've got a note of it. Kill at end of camp. <laughs> All right. It's no. Yeah. Good. Okay. Well, you leave Travis's shop um, after being weirdly confrontational, but you make it outside with your balaclavas and single glove. Is that a Twitch drone still up in the air? Go and make a perception check. All right. Let's not get a negative one. No, we have nine. You do see there's some, like, nice clouds out there, but it's really hard to tell if they're synthetic or not nowadays. Fall down, make a perception check. Fall down? What, what's up? Oh, sorry. That's a make a perception check. Oh, sorry, sorry. I got you. No, no, no. Don't you dare. <laughs> I take it back, I got a 10. <laughs> I got you. Oh, oh thank God. God. Red, you, you look up at the sky as as um, Shift is pointing up at one of the clouds because he's not sure if it's real or fake. And you look at it a little bit closer and with your one extra point, you, you <laughs> about it, it's probably a real cloud. Uh, and while you, yeah, while you guys are doing that, Voldek, you look up at the sky and you do see that there's like two Twitch drones up, in the, up like 10 stories high just kind of going about their business. Hmm... I don't enjoy these Twitch drones keep on following us. Yeah, bro, where the Uvu drones? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Do people still use Uvu? <laughs> uh, Uvu's, Uvu the, the Uvu uh, corporate heads were all assassinated uh -huh. 50 years ago. <laughs> I don't know, guys. Should we just take out every Twitch drone we see until they stop being near us? <laughs> I don't know, man. I, I kind of still work with Twitch sometimes. Okay. Do we, and I don't really want to get on a bad reputation with them without my ball of clock on. Do we want to even take this a step? <laughs> this might be too complicated. But I'm sure we could find some shady people willing to sell us a cadaver. And while she's knocked out, we could transfer some blood to the cadaver and then burn the body so then it looks like it's hurt. I like that. I like that. It does sound very... Work intensive, but it's pretty intricate. It might not be worth the you time. Gotta, you gotta put effort into it if you want it to look good. So I do like the idea. Like cadavers are expensive. Probably. They can be. Yeah. We could always steal the cadaver. We're <laughs> going grave robbing. 
You know what? I should have grabbed that civvy I ran over a while back. God damn it. I mean, they're probably still there. If the police are anything like they were in the past, then they'll take ages to get there. True that. That was only a few days ago, right? Nobody, nobody cares about the streets anymore. Um, well, we but it, uh, considering it's a real person, well, I guess the cadaver nope. is a real person, but we'd have to drain <laughs> it of the blood. <laughs> Cadavers are real people. <laughs> um, you know what? I think that's a bit too complex. I think our current plan is probably fine. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, let's just stick with that then. Yeah, you know, you know where to get any cadavers, my guy. Me. Yeah, Mr. Solo, you, you seem to kill people a lot. You probably know where the morgues are. Do I know where to get a cadaver? Yeah. Do you? Make me a local expert check. I don't know if this necessarily falls within the Solo yeah. side of things. Oh my god. Why have, <laughs> I've got so many failures. Critical failures, dear god. You're not even sure where you are right now. <laughs> what do you mean? I knew how to get here. <laughs> No, you knew how to get the mule's munitions. You didn't know how to get to Travis's threads. I did. did I, I I drove the car here. Oh, true. You, you you tap cadaver. Stop gaslighting me. You tap cadaver into your computers like the car's G, uh, GPS, and nothing pops up, so you don't know. Cornell's cadavers. Do you want me to make a, a local expert check, buddy? Let's, no, let's, all no, think. No. let's let's forget about the cadaver angle. Are you sure? Okay. I mean, unless we all want to do it. He's got a, he's got a pretty good I think it could be expensive. That's my only great. It would be pretty expensive. We could just... uh. I oh. think like the original plan is pretty good. Yeah. The only thing is, if we're talking about scorch marks, do we really have anything that's going to make burn marks? Because I, I, I got a bunch of EMP nades, but I don't have anything... It's not like we got a flamethrower or anything. Maybe I should have picked up one regular nade? I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. It's pretty dangerous. What if you actually blow her up? I mean, we're not going to drop it on her actual body. Her plow. That is true. We're just going to, yeah, like, leave the scorch. I mean, let's at least look. I don't. I don't know. I'm not sure. Do we so we're gonna drop, so, so we're we... gonna drop the scorching and we're just gonna bring out the ketchup package, right? <laughs> we'll stop at McDonald's before we get there, with a bunch of ketchup packets, and just squish them where we shot her. Yeah, man. Yeah. You know. Very true. I do like the scorching though. It's just we don't have any fire weapons. We could always reel her supposed body with bullets and not fire. Very true. So we get a garbage bag, we fill it with leaves, make it look like a person, <laughs> dwap it, smack um, it. Yeah. Um. Hmm. So do we want to look into that? We could, yeah. Maybe. I mean, I have garbage bags at home. Vold no, no, not the garbage bag. <laughs> Dude, we would get found out so fast. I still, I still, uh, I still throw trash away in this, in this day and age. All you right, know what? So. I'm going to go back to Mule's Munition, buy one grenade, regular grenade, and we'll, we'll use that. All right, smart. Cool. Way better idea. Do you want us to chill here? Um, I mean, yeah. I guess I go back I mean, to Mule's Munition and just buy a grenade. Cool. I uh, I pick up a, a leaf that happened to be blown in the wind, and then I uh, I try to do a grass whistle type of thing to pass the time. So you guys basically stand outside of Travis's threads. Well. 
Well, the, uh, well, the shift runs back to Mule's Munitions. Hey. So I got a critical success on my uh, play instrument, so my grass whistle is a, a huge hit. Big dub. Uh, you um, see a single pigeon shows up. <laughs> I feel like I deserve more than a single pigeon for my critical success roll, but okay, I'll take it. The audience, they love me. Uh, Shift, you make it back to, to Mule's Munitions, and I mean, he's he's there. He looks up as you walk in again. Uh, what, is it already defective? No, 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 I just forgot about something. I, I just need a regular nade, or like, you have like an incendiary nade, or like something like that. Uh, right back. You, you want a grenade, or you want incendiary? Incendiary. Uh, he, he, he dicks around a little bit, and then eventually comes back. It, well, I just got uh, some of these from uh, Switzerland, but uh, let me see here. And he I'm plops this down on the table. Like, a Switzerland win wars? I mean, it's not a grenade, but it's Ooh. incendiary. So, so how will it work exactly? I want one of those. You you want to buy this? Yeah, but how do, how does it work? That was my question. You mean stats wise? Like like yeah like so he said it's not a grenade. Like is it a throwable device that just explodes into a flame ball of flame? Okay, uh, so well, we considering that I have shown you a flamethrower, it, it <laughs> operates very similarly to a real life flamethrower. <laughs> oh, I didn't I didn't see the flamethrower in the the Discord chat. Oh. How much? Uh, this, uh, I mean, new product, uh, bits of kind of expensive. We can see here. I can throw in the extra fuel, so you won't, shouldn't have to worry about that. Uh, he pulls out a small pocket calculator. Uh, they, let's see here. I sell it to you for uh, $1,500. $1,500. $1,500. Um, before I decide, do, should I guy, buy this, guys? We're not with you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I need some counsel. I'm talking to the bird in the room. <laughs> I mean, you could call us. I mean, I you guys, yeah, you have company uh, hearing pieces. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm, I'm, I'm contacting the rest of the guys. Be like, hey, bro, the price is fifteen hundred. Should I buy this shit? Uh, does it look cool? I mean, it's a fucking flamethrower. Hey. I say yeah. Um, Voldek is a. Uh, he's off playing with some pigeons right now. Because Nate is on mute. <laughs> uh, I look around. I turn back. I put fifteen hundred on the table. Hand it over, I guess. He really takes the money and then kind of rubs it between his his robotic fingers. Uh, plus, you're doing business with you. Man, dude, I'm already down to a thousand fucking eddies. Oh. Don't worry, bro. We can make Jack, uh, Jack's rich ass pay us back <laughs> later. Um, so stat-wise, how does this work? Uh, good question. Very good question. You know. We're not gonna worry about that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, it, it deals, it deals, um, 46 damage. Alright. Uh, hold on a second. <laughs> uh, it has an effective firing range. Uh, it, can, it can only shoot up to, to 25 meters. I'll make some custom rules for it um, later. But it deals 4d6 damage. And then... If somebody's on fire, they're going to have to do a roll to put themselves out or keep taking 1d6 a turn. Okay. <laughs> and it goes through armor. Okay. Ooh. God damn. All right. Well, um, that was an investment. Um, Shift is packing a bunch of different weapons. Shift does have a lot of weapons. <laughs> uh, like an SMG with a knife on it. 
another SMG, Big Nux, Flamethrower. Grenades. Right. Yeah, grenades, EMP nades. Um, Swag. A car. True. We're going to start having trouble carrying much else. Yeah, you're going to have to start leaving stuff at the, uh, at the office, my guy. Well, my secondary SMG, the one that didn't have the knife, I'm not carrying that anymore, but... The lamer one. Um, anyway, I guess I go back and pick up the other guys. Yeah, you see, you see, uh... <laughs> you see Voldeck playing in the, in the park with some pigeons while Camerahead's filming, I'm assuming. <laughs> yeah, gotta get the views. Look at this dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> It's like one of oh, those you're back. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> you're unmuted. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you, you see Shift <laughs> roll up in your mouth or something. That's why you're still muted. <laughs> no. You, you see Shift roll up in his beater car with a new flamethrower. Damn, your Yo, car was what up? Uh, we back. All right. Did you did you get the flamethrower? I mean, I just wanted a flame nade, but yeah, this works. <laughs> it works. It, it, yeah. it costs a lot more, but it works. Um. So how do how do we want to do this? Like, do we want to invite her to like a a, a dark alleyway? Have Voldek yeah. sniping from like a yeah. decent. Yo, Voldek, can you read my ass so you can get her number off of it? Because uh, I can't really see my ass, so I never really got her number in my phone. Drop those pants. You know, it's a beater car, but but Shift has shown it a lot of love. <laughs> True, true, true. All right, so you, you, you your pants. Uh, all right, my pants are down. <laughs> if a you guys, gives a light little pat as it... he reads the number. <laughs> you see, the other people at the public park are just absolutely <laughs> shocked. Uh, They're in the back of my car, car, aren't they? I mean, you know, <laughs> you're not tinted enough to not see this. I <laughs> get in the car. Yeah, they got in the car. Yeah, I, I, mean, I think we're in the car, but like your windows are still not tinted enough for not to be seen. Shift is just kind of like pointing the, the car that is... Shift's pointing the flamethrower at you and be like, if you guys were anybody else, I would flame the fuck out of you. I rolled down the window and I let out a fart. <laughs> this episode, man. Dear God. <laughs> oh <my> God. <laughs> All right. Hi, your kid. looks like it's it's six nine six nine four twenty. Nice, nice. All right, I put that in my phone. Give her a call. Wait, wait, wait! We haven't decided where we're doing this. Uh, oh. Phone rings a few times, and and uh, Lily Rose kind of picks up. Hey, Lily Rose speaking. Uh, Thank you for the gift subs. <laughs> I hang up immediately. <laughs> <laughs> wait, so what are we doing? <laughs> I mean, yeah, we, we should. We could have a. We could have it be like a. A dirty prostitute situation where we meet her in the alley and we want to yeah. have sex by the dump. That's what I was thinking. We just need to pick the, <laughs> the alley and one where you can have a decent vantage point. Yeah. True, true, true. So what about that uh, that alley on off of 25th Street? It's uh, got the fire exit up there, you know? Not very true. public. Sounds, I'm down sounds, for that. Um, sounds I, like a thing. Out of the four EMP nades, I hand one to Voldek and one to to Camerahead and be like, if there's a drone or anything, toss it at it. Alrighty. But uh, I'll toss one right at her feet when this all starts. <laughs> so are we shooting or are we nading? Um, we'll see. What, what we'll do is we'll have an EMP nade go off first and see how that works, and then we'll start shooting. We need to make it look like a bit of a shit show, I think. You know, it's gonna yeah, take yeah. My camera for a little bit too. <laughs> I we think should make sure that none of these twists are these sacrifices. You know what might have to happen? It sounds pretty brutal. I might have to rip out her eye. Oh, fuck. with the with the <laughs> yeah. electronic shit in it. Yeah. Was it a camera, or did it just really kind of switch to premium mode? Well, it looked uh, like it was connected the, to her Twitch. From the yeah, from the up close and personal look you got at it, uh, camera head. It's basically just a chat replay, so she can read the chat without having to see anything. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So it's not really a camera, then. It just gives her. Her eye. 
a text to read back. She don't have to rip out her eye. I, I kind of like her with her eyes. Both of them. I mean, she could always get it replaced. Just being, oh, just being safe, you know? True, 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 true. Alrighty, so we got the location down. Can, yeah. I, can I call her? Yeah, just tell her to meet you there in like a couple of hours or some shit. Cool. I uh, I call I call six nine six nine four twenty once again. Lily Rose, what the fuck do you want? Uh, sorry about that. You know what I want. I want. Yeah, you. I know. I'm, I'm already uh, in the middle of something though, and you can hear bit porn sounds on the other end of the phone. Uh -huh. <laughs> but uh. Well, uh, when you free up later, because I know that guy isn't uh, as impressive as me in endurance. Uh, I, need I don't you know, to... I'll put it to a vote on chat. <laughs> uh, they say he's better. Oh, well, uh, they obviously forgot about me already, and I need to prove them wrong. I, I read your note. <clears throat> uh, good stuff. Appreciate it. Tell you what, why don't you meet me in front of uh, in front of the space needle once I'm done here? Cool, cool. That's kind of not. Wait, I need to discuss this with the boys. Hey guys, so she wants to meet in front of the space needle. That's nowhere near like a dark alley. What do we want to do about that? Well, you could meet her in front of the space needle and lead her somewhere else. Cool, cool, cool. Alrighty. Lily, I'll see you there. Uh, five minutes? That guy's not impressive, right? Five minutes, yeah. Let's go. Give it, let's give it a 15. 15? Uh, I still she think so. Awesome, but okay. <laughs> no, oh. Lily's so, kind of a bitch. Um, are we stunning you, uh, Camerhead? Before? I don't, I, don't, I don't think so. I don't know. I thought we were so that it looks like... I was like, y'all are going to shoot me at first, but like, I don't... I think the thing changed a little bit. I are think we should so that we're... Y'all can shoot me. Well, right, y'all can shoot me. I mean, I do have no, the... I do have stun the, grenade. I do have the blanks loaded in, so I could just shoot you. Cool. Oh, I yeah, yeah, yeah. I take it. It's just a scratch. Cool. You actually just fucking shoot me by accident. <laughs> yeah, I forget to load, <laughs> unload the bullet in the chamber. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh... You can I come throw on my... Camera head. I throw on my mask. I'm like, let's do this, boys. Cool. Alright, you drop me off at the Space Needle while y'all go and set up for, uh... for the mission, alright? I bet. I think we're all good, yeah. Cool, cool. Alrighty. I, uh, pull out the condoms I, already, I always carry. The future condoms. The future condoms. <laughs> Carmen's condoms. They grow on your dick. When you need them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they grow to the sides of your dick. <laughs> uh. Alright, right. you guys You guys head off to the, to the Space Needle. Um... You make it there, you know. It's it's mid to late afternoon. Um, you guys, I guess, park a ways off, and and camera head. You go up to the kind of the entrance area. Alrighty, where is she? Where is she? Uh, it's a solid ten minutes um, before you see Lily Rose show up. Um, she pulls up in in her car into a nearby parking lot. I thought um, she had a motorcycle. Can I, can I throw up a perception to make sure there's no drones that are like have a beat on us? Yeah, sure, go for it. Oh, she's got a cool car. I wish I had a car. It's it's very hot pink. Uh, twenty two. I'm gonna steal that. Yeah. You 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 don't see any drones that have a beat on you, but you do see like there's a variety of drones up at the top of the space needle. <laughs> All right, guys. So very off topic with the session, but I just got an email about erectile dysfunction, <laughs> and I feel like my phone is listening to me because of the fucking condom comment. <laughs> oh, God. Welcome to Cyberpunk. <laughs> uh, you see Lily kind of steps out of the, the car, you know. She's wearing a, 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 the same bikini at this point. Um, 
but is still surrounded by like five cameras. As she kind of makes her way over, to, over you with a smile. Um, walking over, you see she kind of pulls a needle out of somewhere uh, and jabs it into her arm before throwing it into a nearby bush. Oh, cool. So she does drugs, drugs. I thought she was going to hey. do this for real. So how you been? Hey, Hood, how's it going? It's, uh, it's going pretty good. You uh, seemed to have cheered up a bit since uh, the phone call. Well, you know, serotonin is a hell of a drug. True. And also, I can't afford to fall asleep. Oh, that makes sense. Mm-hmm. Uh, thanks for meeting me here, though. Of course. Anytime. I actually have a more private place that I want to take you later, if that's okay. Sure, I mean, you got me, you, the three million other viewers, let's go for it. Three million. <laughs> three million. <laughs> oh, I wish I got three million viewers. Uh, but she seems, I mean, she seems prepared to follow you wherever. She kind of, she kind of looks at you knowingly, because she's, she's read the note that you guys are, are willing to take her job and help her out. Nice, nice. All right, so I lead her to the, the boys. No, don't lead her to us. Well, I mean, oh. we're, we're hiding, right? Because you're, you're okay, in a car in a parking I, lot. I lead her to the place that I'm supposed to lead her to. <laughs> I gotta lead them to y'all. She's not gonna see y'all, of course. Okay, uh, so Voldek and, and Shift, why don't you tell me what you guys are doing? Uh... All right, so I'm gonna get posted up on said fire escape. Like, so you're just in some alley. Yeah, we're the alley on Twenty Fifth Street. The alley on Twenty Fifth Street next to the space station. <laughs> yeah, he, yeah he, he's you a- don't do your uh, Seattle research. You don't know about Twenty Fifth Street. I don't either. I'm joking. <laughs> right, you guys, you guys have the car parked in Twenty Fifth Street. Voldeck, you make your way up to the fire well, escape and, and shift. The the car is parked a couple of blocks away from this av, this 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 uh hide because I don't want my car spotted. Don't worry, bro. nobody knows what your car looks like. It's just a beater. Don't you insult my car? <laughs> you saw what happened. Like last guy who shot my car. Oh, true, true, true. Um, I'm hiding behind a dumpster that's not facing the direction they're coming in. So when I hear them walking. I'm gonna throw an EMP nade at their feet. <laughs> would that would that fuck you up, Cameron? <laughs> That's all. I think so, cause like it's gonna turn my eye off for a little bit, probably. Shit. But like, I'm not too cyber enhanced, so I won't be like put out of commission or anything. So you're okay with that? Yeah, go for it. Okay. All deck make me stealth rolls. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> you won this hole. No shit! Hold on, I closed the app by accident. It works. You dusty bitch. Critical success! I'm the stealthiest motherfucker. Oh my god! Oh wow, you got a you got a crit on your crit there. You, uh, wow. Yeah. You're hiding. You? You're hiding in a different campaign, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually in fifth edition. Yeah. Right now. <laughs> uh, Thirteen from me. <laughs> Yeah, well, you guys hide the best you can. Uh, some people better than the others. The best I can. <laughs> <laughs> better than others. This man literally looks like the fire escape. <laughs> I somehow <laughs> developed chameleon powers. <laughs> <laughs> it's the cloaking device, bro. You look down yeah. from the fire escape and you see Shift kind of just crouched behind a dumpster. <laughs> <laughs> Stealth is my uh, forte. Uh, Camerahead, you you lead Lily Rose uh, to the alleyway, and you know you guys are just having your conversation. So I don't know about you, but Twitch streaming has been uh, quite a change in my life. But, you know, how did you get into it? You know, uh, moved out of my parents' house, needed some money. Friend told me that uh, Twitch was a pretty good option, so I was like, you know what? I like cameras. I like people. I need views. So I did it. You know? All right, Chad, if you want to tune in for the exclusive interview between me and Camerahead later tonight, make sure to, to pay for the after hours special bonus, all right? Well, you, you use everything, huh, for, for your viewers? Well, you got it. It's the life I live. And she looks at you with, with <laughs> vacant eyes, just soulless. <laughs> oh, God. Look. I pull out my phone really quick and I <laughs> I text shift really quick. I see your head poking up, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I definitely duck down even harder. I'm like, oh, what the fuck? Oh, me? <laughs> oh, 
you know, I'm not a huge fan of, of having sex in alleyways, but I suppose I've been in worse positions. So, um, here we are. Here we are. How, how close so, uh, are they to me? I, uh, I undress her very slowly. Oh, hold on, wait. Well, that's not that hard. Oh. She's only wearing two pieces. <laughs> <laughs> Where are we? Where are they? In an alley. We're in the alley, bro. We're, we're with you, bro. No, you can throw the you can throw the grenade once uh once our cities are out, bro. Okay. Yeah, you you hear a thump against the other side of the dumpster shift. All right. Um. Uh, sure. Proceed. Another proceed dump, there. Another another I suck on a nipple. <laughs> okay. The grenade is going. The grenade is going around the corner. The grenade comes around. <laughs> <laughs> Splooges on it. <laughs> I, uh, I well, okay, hold on. I throw the nade in a way that it, like I'm not in. Well, hold on. I don't have any. Tech on me. I think you can be in range. It won't yeah, affect you. Yeah, I don't have any cybernetics besides my fists. Yeah. Make me an athletics check. Eighteen. Uh, yeah. Uh, Camerahead, you're getting up those titties, and then you kind of see, kind of chucked over the um the dumpster, just a a single one of those grenades from earlier that just kind of sits there um, before exploding out. To make it seem uh, to make it seem authentic, I was like, whoa, watch out! You know, as I slam her into the grenade. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she, she, she cries out in kind of surprise and pain, but as, as like, drones start raining from the sky down, <laughs> just clattering onto the cement, there's like five of them that just kind of buzz. Um, I signal the Voldek to start shooting the drones. Um, yeah, I start taking shots at these drones. Uh, I mean, they're on the ground. Well, pop, pop, pop. I still don't shoot me. <laughs> okay, you you start you start shooting at the drones and and um, you know, conf- confused and not knowing what's going on. Um, Lily Rose kind of just like, oh Jesus Christ, what the fuck, and puts herself up against the wall. <laughs> I, 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 I at, at, looking at you now on the fire escape. With with my Bella Clava on, I walk around the corner and just fire two blank rounds at both of their faces. <laughs> but first, she, she, she winces. Well, the first, oh, the, it's you. The first shot goes at Camerhead, and he falls to the ground dead. Right? <laughs> so Wait, I'm dead. Well, like, you we know have, what I mean. We have the camera the, or the ketchup packets ready to go. Yeah, I, I fall to the floor with my with my ketchup pocket packet in my pocket. I pull it out and I squeeze it. Uh, ah! Rose watches this, and then as as shift as you point the gun at her and shoot a blank off in her face, she just kind of looks at you. You're supposed to play dead. Oh, uh, oh, yeah. Uh, uh, she falls to the ground carefully. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Dumbass. <laughs> well, I mean, if all the drones are down, we could just talk normally, right? Oh. Yeah, but, like, I was worried there was going to be more drones and stuff like that. Like, watching from the sky. Well, I mean, if they're all if they're all down, we probably have at least a few minutes before the Twitch mods send more after me. All right, uh, all right you then. know. How, how, what's your plan of action from here? How are we I, I read your note. Thank you so much for, for picking this up. Uh, it, it means a lot to me, but yeah. Um, really, I need your just assistance. I figured you people would know how to stage somebody's death, so I figured you might be the best ones to ask. I, I don't know, really. Um, but, I mean, whatever whatever you guys have in mind, I'm, I'm willing to follow along with. I had some ideas. I mean... What's what's your plan? Uh, I Well, I thought that maybe if we, if we like, set my car on fire or something... Um, that could work. Maybe we could do something like that and the smoke would, would distract the drones or something. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, chat's getting really antsy. I mean, if you're connected to chat, don't the, doesn't that mean they know you're still around, though? I mean, the, the people can use the chat even when the stream's not going. No, I know, but if you're connected to chat, doesn't Twitch recognize that you're connected to it? Yeah, I mean, like, is she still online? Wait, did I mean, the UMP grenade not take out her her eye too? Uh, yeah, you can see that she she kind of slaps her eye around a little bit as it's bugging out. Um, okay, okay. Well, what did you have in mind? 
Well, we we're going to essentially, I pull up the flamethrower. We we're just going to light this place on fire and make it look like you were just like turned to ash. And with all the drones destroyed. I don't. Is that going to work? I mean, lighting your car on fire, what, what's that going to do? Well, I don't know. I thought maybe you would have a dead body to put in it. Bro, oh, fuck. Uh, is there any hopeless Blaster. people around here? Uh, go ahead. I mean, mm, go ahead and make me... Is there any other people? Is that what we just said? <laughs> I was yeah. joking about that. Uh, just check the uh, check the dumpster, bro. Somebody might get a perception check. A perception check? Let's see if there's any people. Oh my god, I'm rolling so bad. You guys are in an alleyway. Nobody heard that noise. Definitely not. Voldek, you're on the fire escape, and you do see, like... <laughs> you do see that up at the tippy top of the uh, Space Needle, some of the drones have started to kind of shift and and start f floating down slowly. Alright, guys, we gotta wrap this up soon. Alright. Uh -huh. As long as you are disconnected from the system, you just disappear... I think we'll be... F Hold on. T take that, whatever, her top and put it in the middle of those drones and I'll just light it all on fire. Cool. Um, she she watches as you as you set fire to her bikini top. And all the drones. That was expensive. Okay, well, you know. I mean, you're trying to die here. Don't worry, we know a clothing guy. I've been a lot more naked in public before, so I guess this is fine. <laughs> we know a clothing guy. <laughs> <Cool>. <laughs> Um, uh, you get you you start yeah you start setting fire to the scene, um, as the smell of just burning metal, kind of raises through the air. It's okay. pretty bad. Yeah. All right, daddies, we gotta get up out of here with the thotty. Yeah, I guess we we start kind of moving to the car, if we if we can okay. get there stealthily. Yeah, you guys get in the into the car. Um, you know, you're sitting in the back. So, hanging out um, with, a, with a topless Lily Rose. Yeah, with, with topless Lily Rose there. So, what was your plan yeah. after you died? Uh, I would. Well, I was hoping that maybe I could flee the country. I don't really. Maybe get a face change. I. I would thought I'd. That was part of your guys's expertise, really. Um, oh. Uh, I don't know, man. We we do usually send where, people. Where, where, where are we going? Um, you know what? I'm gonna take her to um Cecilia's, like the tattoo parlor. What was that? Oh, called? sure. Was it called see? Snake Scales? Um, yeah, Snake Scales. Uh, yeah. You guys go ahead and you you speed off um through the streets. Go ahead and make me a driving check. <laughs> runs over a fucking person again. It's possible. Thank God. Oh my God. He's fucking doing wheelies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you see, you see, right um, shift basically just tears it down the asphalt. You know, within two minutes, you guys are across down to, to snake scales. I mean, time to go see CC. Um, kind of a... Uh... Yeah, well, you guys, you guys make it, um... Into the to the very neon colored tattoo parlor, um, you see good old pal uh, Cecilia's inside. You know they're they're there in their neon tattooed glory. Um, kind of look up as you walk in, along with the the topless streamer, and they just kind of look at you and go. So is this new for you, or is this just something I'm learning about now? This is very new. Um... This person here, um, Pinky. What, what's his face in the back? Was it Jimmy or who is it in the back? I forgot his name. Kyle. What, uh, Kyle? Did you say? Yeah. Okay. Or sorry, Neil. 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 Okay, Neil. Hey, is, he, is Neil in? Uh he 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 stepped out for for lunch, um, but I mean his office is open. Uh, what do you? Need, what do you need? She needs some uh, surgery. 
Oh. Okay. Well, feel free to make yourselves comfortable. Cool, cool, cool. Do you have anything we could, like, throw on her to, like, cover up? No, bro, I like her titties. Uh, sh- sure. She goes to her closet and pulls out, like, an overcoat. Tosses it at her. Um, there, there you go. <laughs> right. I, yeah, you see, Lily Rose kind of just puts it on with a little bit of disinterest. Um, I feel like feels a little bit weird against her skin. This plan really just went to hell. Honestly, ah, uh, bro, we we haven't failed yet. Yeah. There are no drones in here. Yeah, We're chilling. Well, you, you need to understand that I think if if Twitch ever finds out or something, if if this doesn't work, though, I mean, they're gonna put even more cameras and security on me. I don't know if I could make, like, a second try. I mean, they won't... If you don't listen. look like you, then you should be fine, right? They, they won't find out, right? They track your eye? Should we should we snatch your eye out? I'm uh, pain adverse, but... Hey, what's, what's, what's life without a little pain, you know? What's Throw life away. without never sleeping for two weeks in a row just to make your paycheck? Yeah, you've been to worse. You could get your eyes snatched out. Possibly. Let's let's wait for Deal yeah. to get back and uh, sure consult him. Deal. Yo, CC. Look at my tattoo. You did this. Um, I, I kind of I, I kind of look at her and be like, "Can you, like, do you have money to afford this? If 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 you want to go through like a face change." Ah, uh, I mean. Yes, I have I have some saved up, I suppose. Uh, I mean, not super super wealthy, but I I have money. Okay, that's that's what we like to hear, like a woman with a bankroll. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. So uh, you guys all hang out at Snake Scales for for about like twenty five minutes ish. Can I raid the fridge? Is there a fridge? Uh, there, <laughs> you see, if uh, there might be one in, in Niall's office. Yo, CC, can I have some orange Where juice? Else? What happened uh, to the yogurt? I mean, that's not mine, but uh, sure. I think it's mine then. <laughs> Slurp. Slurp. I want to throw a perception to make sure there's no drones. I want to listen. Smart idea. I'm going to sneak a peek outside. Critical success. Uh, 24. Voldek, you go ahead and you go to the window and kind of look out. Um, and you see, you know, up in the sky, there's there are several drones kind of scanning the different streets. And you, you look down and you do and you see um, good old Dr. Neil uh, across the street. It looks like he's talking to somebody. Uh, you see, like, two very heavily armed individuals who seem to be kind of Fuck. pressing him about something. Oh. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Isn't Dr. Neil the... Um, Dr. Neil's the one that we're waiting on, right? Yeah. yeah. You, you see, he, he kind of gestures to the store a few times, uh, and it looks like there's some argument going on. Alright, guys, I think we gotta dip. Uh, why is that? Because Dr. Neil is being talked to by two heavily armed people, and he just pointed towards us, and I just don't like where this situation is going. Mm, that is very true. So, where are we going to go? So, uh, you see... <laughs> CC, uh, he picks up, uh, if you, if you guys want to hide in the back room for, for now, maybe. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Okay. Right. He always knows what's best. I thought, I thought we were already hiding in the back room. No, we were just chilling. We were just chilling in the t- tattoo parlor. Oh, yeah, we you you guys go through the back door that leads to to Neil's kind of um, lounge slash operating table slash office, and you see there's that weird animatronic kind of too realistic cat head sitting on his desk that looks at you as you walk in. Cool. I spit out my orange juice. That thing freaks me out every time. You've never come back here before, have you? Shh. Of course I've come back here, bro. I'll be I'll be chilling back here every time I visit CC, bro. Right. 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 
What do you mean? As you guys discuss, you do you hear the the jingle of the open of the door opening and, and heavy footsteps kind of come in. Um, Can it be the family mart jingle? You hear you hear what sounds to be kind of the the murmurs of discussion in the other room. I think we need to get the fuck out of here. But I mean, is is there a back door? I've never seen a back door. Is there a back door out of here? Make a perception check. It's pretty pretty easy. Twenty one. Uh, no, no, wait, that's not me. <laughs> Thirteen. Bro, <laughs> 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 I was so happy I did roll out a roll. <laughs> Sorry. Just a, like a very plain and simple back door. Um, nothing fancy. All right, let, let's get out of here. Alrighty, we, we snatch Lily up. Oh dear. I don't mean like that. <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> we lead her out. Uh, you you take her by the hand and you guys uh, go into the back alleyway. Um, there's a lot of trash back here. Headless cat bodies and whatnot. Uh huh. Okay, what's the fucking plan now, guys? Uh, uh, that's a good question. Are there any drones following us? Uh, in this in this very like kind of narrow alleyway, you look up at the what sky you can see, and I mean, you see like a single drone just go overhead. Cool, cool. So we gotta get up out of here. I don't know where we're going now. Yeah, we don't really have like a backup plan. Yeah, we never really think things through. Huh? <laughs> yeah, we weren't really think. We were just like, oh, but this could be so easy. Um, <laughs> it's probably why we have a fourth member of our team. <laughs> yeah, who actually thinks things <laughs> yeah, through. A person and a person who is able to get people out of the country. Yeah, <laughs> uh, Lily Rose kind of picks up a little bit. Hear, hear me out. I know it's a little bit cliche, but but maybe if we go back to where they they wouldn't think to look, like the Space Needle or something. That could work. Yeah, sure, why not? Well, what do we do after? But it could also end in. Uh, I mean, we go back there and do what though? True. True. Well, I just noticed that all the ones that were were up at the top of the Space Needle seem to have come back down. True. All right, Charlie said that. All right, yeah, sounds good to me. I have no objections. We head there. Uh, as you guys drive over to the base needle, um, camera head, you see that that Lily's kind of holding onto your hand a little bit tightly, as it seems she's nervous. Oh baby, I don't know it was like that. Don't worry, we got this. This plan will uh will work out. We'll kill everything if we have to. Bro, this no, this campaign's like, about to so be so fucked. We're fucked. <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't know that. This campaign's about to be taking down the entirety of Twitch for this one girl. As, as you guys make it closer to the space and you kind of drive past that area you torched, and you do see there's like three heavily armed individuals and like four Twitch drones just surveying the area. Oh mm-hmm. fuck! We just keep driving. I give, uh, I give Voldek a little hand signal that just means bros before hoes. Don't worry. I will kill this bitch if I have to. <laughs> <laughs> if this plan goes too south. Uh, but you guys you guys make your way to the I mean the Space Needle parking lot. All right, what do we want to do? Right. Now? Well, that's a good question. This is her plan. Uh I I mean we could try to hide in the in the crowd, I guess. I don't know. I mean, you. I have. I'm wearing, I do have an overcoat on. That is true. We should give her our balaclavas, or one of them. <laughs> Not all of Definitely them. Then we make her stand out a bit more. Oh, true. That is if true. Only we had gotten the Gucci one. <laughs> yeah, the fashion. <laughs> I knew I should have stole it. Should have. Fuck. Well, okay. <sighs> What what's our plan after though? What are we gonna do? How are we gonna hide her? How are we gonna? All right, this is what we do. We take her to our good old pal Daisy Duke, and we say, "Hey, keep an eye on this chick for us," you know. And then what? Da- Daisy, we don't want to just burn Daisy with a random wanted girl. That is very true. 
Like, we need some kind of plan to either get her face reconstructed or get her out of here. Okay. Hmm. Or... Contact Neil or some other reconstructive surgeon. I mean, Neil um, was already yeah. being heavily questioned by those guards, which I don't know how. Neil they, will us out. I don't know how the hell they found him that quick. They might have followed my yeah. car. I have no fucking idea. Yeah. Do you know yeah. though? They found him, but as far as they know, he has no connection to us yet. True. Though I'm pretty sure Cecilia probably said, oh yeah. Like, I mean, unless she covered for us, which if she did, I goddamn will appreciate That's that. Why would she not cover for us? She's a real one. Yeah, she inked our bodies up. So, this is what we do, okay? So we're gonna... We're gonna go to the top of the Space Needle, right? And we're gonna throw this chick off, except not really. <laughs> We're gonna throw the overcoat off. I mean, with like kind of weight on it. Okay. What? Just in front of the drones. I mean, there's no drones oh. specifically here now, right? Yet, but they're bound to come at any time. And we we place her body at the bottom. We plant her body right with the ketchup packets, so it looks like she actually fucking died. But they would just walk up to her body and be like, "Bro, she's alive." Oh, true. I'm kind of stupid. Uh, All I eat is yogurt and orange juice. Shit. I don't have brain power. <laughs> we need the smart person for a group. Fuck. Where is he? <laughs> oh, we need his connections. <laughs> Jack Deacon, where are you? Um, Deacon. <laughs> Deacon. It's like, you know the scene when Pain that, like fucks everything up? Spoilers for people who haven't seen Naruto. Um, <laughs> when Pain fucks everything up and... Soccer is just like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I know exactly what you're talking about. Uh, you can, like, text him. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to message Deacon on the on the comms and be like, bro, you know a way to get somebody out of the country real quick? Oh, bro, I mean, helicopters. Out of the country? Well, how else would you get somebody out of the country? A helicopter? We know you have one. I do have a helicopter. I'm Jack Deacon. All right, we we, we go over I'm, to Jack. Dude, I'm, steal I'm Jack Deacon. I'm a I'm Batman. <laughs> I'm shit. Honestly, <laughs> where is she? Can we borrow that giant right quick, bro? Yeah. Uh, where where are you at right now? The Space Needle, my guy. Okay. I uh, Google I mean, up. I'll try to get past my board of directors, but I can send a helicopter up there. Well, nice. Yeah. All right. Hello. It's going to be a few hours, but just, I mean, be ready for it. Hours? <laughs> Ow. Should we, like, go there to the, goes. like, top of uh, the space needle? Being with the crowd, I guess. So we just have to chill at the top of the space needle and not get noticed. Yeah, well... I think you that then. Yeah, I guess, I guess let's do that, then. Do we want to? Cool. Yeah, sure. Yeah, let's go. Alright, fam, I hope you brought your running shoes, because we finna up these stairs. I messaged Jack. I'm like, we'll be at the top of the Space Needle. You messaged you? Jack. Deacon. Oh, okay. So, so, sounds good. Alright. Alright. One hour later. So you guys, you guys basically make it into the Space Needle. Um... You see that there's like pretty decent, sizable crowd in there. Um, you have you three, and uh, Lily Rose, who's wearing a overcoat. Overcoat. Um, but you guys make your way inside the space needle. You see that in 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 2078, um, the space needle is pretty nice. And there's neon staircases and water features and gift shops all over on the inside. Um, yeah. As well as a very large crowd of people. You know, I've lived here my whole life, but I've still never come to the Space Needle. It's pretty it's nice. Wild, One second. I, I gotta... Um, yeah, but you see that there's several elevators that kind of go up to the top terrace. 
elevator. There's also the the thousand story staircase. So we're taking the stairs, right, guys? Yeah, I mean it'll, I, it'll kill the hours. Oh, I, I was joking. I'm not in shape like that, my guy. Oh, you can take. I guess I'll take the elevator with you guys. <laughs> Back into an, uh, an elevator with a bunch of other people. Um, I kind of position myself, well, to like kind of block Lily so that people can't really like see her. Okay, go to make me a stealth check. Eighteen. Okay. Um, I would have voted for the stairs, but <laughs> oh, would you? Yeah, but it's okay. We would have stood out as weirdos. Yeah, so the four of you are all, all kind of stuffed into this elevator as it kind of makes the way up the um, the many different floors. <clears throat> you see it stops on the second, the third floor, the fourth floor. More and more people start to... Um, and as you get onto the sixth floor, you very casually, um, one of these armored figures, you know, everything holstered, just hold on you're like cutting out tom what did you say yeah yeah, yeah. oh sorry my voice uh, uh, oh. oh he's gone <laughs> the dm is dead uh anyway so so you guys get into the elevator um right. you know you kind of try to hide her from view seems to work um you see the elevator starts to climb the stories second story third story fourth story um more and more people kind of getting on as you guys get up to like the sixth story um the elevator opens and one of these heavily kind of armored people steps onto the elevator pretty casually um wiping sandwich crumbs off their face <laughs> like when you mean armored people like do they are they just like armored security that's normal at, normally at the space and you know uh, go ahead and make me a perception check. 16, and then Voldex the 22. Uh, you guys both see these... These these people are, are seem weirdly well-armored, um, but also wearing kind of just normal clothes on top of it, with their faces covered and, and weapons holstered. Um, you do see kind of... With those rolls, you see the the Twitch logo kind of hidden um, a little bit on the side of their mask. Fuck me. Yeah. We should have took the stairs like Molding yeah. said. Ugh. Yeah. Uh, also, sorry, Cole. I, I always just assume that my perception is going to be higher than yours. I so mean, I'm like, it, I'm it, it has this. been in every case, so I don't mind. <laughs> I, really, I really don't mind. Um, okay, um... Well, hmm. How many other people in the elevator are there? Almost a dozen. Okay. It is extremely crowded. And cool. and we're at the back, and they're at the front. Correct. Okay. Um, my my hand is in my jacket. Like I'm just kind of having my arm crossed, but my hand is on my gun. Okay. All right, boys. I say that if this does not go south, we let them get off of the elevator or whatever floor they're going to stop at, and we get out uh, on the floor after them, and then we take the stairs the rest of the way. Yeah. Yeah. So good plan to me. But if we have to, we can just, you know, kill this dude. Yeah. Um, eventually, the, the elevator side. goes up all 20 something stories up to the terrace uh and there's a ding as the doors open and people start to file out uh you see as the the this inconspicuous individual kind of lets everybody else um go first as he hangs back there's only one of them oh, sorry uh, yeah there's there's the one man um but before long it's you know as people start filing out you see he's kind of over by the the control panel um, fiddling with it, but before in a in a matter of seconds, it's just you four uh, and him as he's pressing some buttons. 
We should try um, and sneak past it. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna try just trying to slip out, slip out with the crowd. Yeah. Alright. Uh, make me... Stealth. Stealth. No! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Ethan! <laughs> God damn it, I can't roll right today! Dude. Oh no. Minus four of you exit the elevator. Shift right as you're the last one to exit. Uh, you hear the man kind of hop up. Hey, wait a moment. <laughs> Stop right there, criminal <laughs> scum. Hey, okay. uh, excuse I, me. Um, so wait, excuse me. Is he in the door of the I elevators? Go in front of yeah, he's 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 still inside the elevator at the at the controls. Hey, hey excuse me. Yeah. Do Do you know what uh, floor of the parking garage is on? I mean. The elevator should say, and I just walked away. Fucking cunt, and the door is closed. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's four nine. I yell out. Uh, but you guys are out on the terrace, uh, and this place is extremely crowded. You see that there's like different cafes and food stalls up here, uh, as well as just a huge number of tourists. Yo, that was about, and other people. That was about to be like John Wick three, where he's like shooting those guys in the armor in the head. Like, expecting them to die, and I was about to just pull out and start hitting this guy. That was close. Mostly yeah. he just wanted to get to the parking garage. Alright. I'm gonna I'm a throw out a perception, make sure there's no no suspicious individuals. 22, pretty good. Um, Why are you just getting constant 22s, my man? Dude, I don't fucking know. I'm just kidding here again, like, I have failures. I do have a lot in the perception. I have six in the perception, so I have I have uh, you, four critical failures. This session. God damn it! Man. <laughs> you you survey the the terrace and the kind of the surrounding area, and you see um, a ton of people. You you do see what looks to be a few more of these people on their lunch break, much like the last guy. Um, but they have their masks pulled up and weapons kind of at their side. They're not looking at anywhere except at their meals. All right. Nice, nice. Let's just try and keep low key, yeah. and we'll we'll just be for the, the copter. Yeah, we'll um, we should discuss way. how we're gonna get this bitch out of the country. I mean, how are we gonna get to the copter? Like, it's gonna be on the roof, yeah. Yeah. Is there... Yeah, we're we're gonna have a little shootout, but it's fine. No, are are there? Okay, walking around, is there like a maintenance exit to go up to like the top of the space needle? Um, I mean, you guys are on the terrace. There, There is, like, a maintenance hatch probably somewhere in the stairwell, you could guess. Um, Alright, I guess I'm gonna head to the stairwell and look. Cool. Okay. Yeah, you find the emergency exit and kind of open it a little bit and see the maintenance hatch that goes up to the very tippy top. Um, seems pretty narrow. Does it say anything like, alarm will sound? I think the alarm already sounded if you went out of the emergency exit. <laughs> no, like, I didn't open I it, did. but I, I just looked to see if there was one. There, There is one thing that says, like, employees only with a huge, like, orange triangle and exclamation point. Doesn't sound like an alarm to me. We'll be fine. I, I, I messaged the other guys, be like, hey, I found our way out of here when the helicopter gets here, so let's just chill. Gee. Yeah. So, I'm gonna uh, grab myself a hot dog. Yeah. I think, I'll, uh, think I'll grab one too. I guess I I just make sure Lily is like never her face is never facing those guards and we're always like looking away from them. Okay. Yo, Lily, you um, plug? Yeah, I mean that's not too difficult. I won't make you roll for it. You guys just kind of uh, hide yourselves in a corner of the room while you eat lunch, uh, and Lily just kind of watches you guys eat, hanging out. Does she want any? I, I pull out a toothpick and be like, "You want one?" Uh, I'm good. I haven't really felt hungry in in a week. It, you don't oh. you don't eat a toothpick. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. I think Lily's retarded. <laughs> I was talking to 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 camera head, but okay. <laughs> but I was offered her I a toothpick. Failure. <laughs> Oh, you're looping the whole queue, so it's gonna play failure every time. <laughs> <laughs> failure. Um. 
Uh, I don't need a toothpick. Alright. Are you trying to say you're a nasty crow? What? So, Lily, what do you want to do here? What is your desired outcome? Do you want to leave the country? Do you want to reconstruct your face? What's up? Just whatever, whatever it takes. Don't, for... don't whatever me. This isn't wait, 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 when you're asking your girlfriend where you want to go get food. All right, this is your choice. I mean, I guess with the uh, I mean, the helicopter with the helicopter coming. getting here, we could probably get her to Vancouver pretty quickly. I'm sorry, you're right. I I want to be able to just live anywhere else where nobody's going to recognize me or see me or do anything. Facial reconstruction could be an option. Just, I don't know, getting myself off the public records would probably be the best. And honestly, I don't know if our... Uh, staged attempts is going to convince anybody. I know, but if you just disappear, no. it won't matter necessarily. I hope so. You worked so I hard mean, on that. What, what I recommend is we'll, the helicopter will be here. We'll get you out of here. But in terms of getting... I would recommend as uh, on top of getting you out of the country, you get some sort of surgery to change your look slightly. Whatever that be, because oh, you're here. Because you know, as soon as we get you across the border, I personally think our job ends there. Yes. Um. Thank. Thank you for all the the help you've you've given me and all the good dick you've given me. I really appreciate it. Um, no problem. <laughs> but, yes. Uh. Hopefully, we can. I can put this all. Behind myself, I hope. So. Um. I do like your behind. What? You could put camera head behind yourself. I do like her behind. <laughs> it's a nice behind. I mean, it, and and if, if anyone does come after you. Um, Shift kind of stealthily kind of hands over a knife to her. You can use this to defend yourself. Uh, she gives you kind of like a weak smile and, and slips it into her coat. Unless you wanted a gun. I, I don't know how to use one, but okay. A gun. No, the knife's fine. I just, re I, I just yes. realized I said that I left my other SMG in the locker at the work. Old deck, why don't you make me a perception check? Got you. No! <laughs> I'm a, my luck ran out of perception! <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna make my perception check too. Let's see if I can do better. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> just barely? It's still not better wow. than the base roll. Are we all making perception checks? I mean, if you want to. Yo, yo, please, Camerhead. Oh, oh no. <laughs> uh, with a, I mean, 14 is not great, but you, what you do see, you notice that the, the other people who are kind of sitting at the same cafe in the corner um, have started looking at you and at Lily. I mean, she's covered, though, right? Well, but the jacket? She, she's wearing an overcoat, yes. Okay. Um... But they're they're still kind of looking at her and whispering to each other. I kind of look over and be like, "Do you guys have a problem?" Face down, face down, face down. I mean, they 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 go back to their sandwiches, uh, but still whisper to each other. They're about to be a fucking flamethrower here. Uh, flame these goddamn <laughs> cities. You're in my range. Um. But anyway, as you, as you kind of bark over at them, uh, you do see, like, the occasional sideways glance, and the other people kind of sitting next to you have, have started to kind of just look and and watch as they're wondering, where have I seen that girl before? Uh, What's, do you know her? 
do we want to just get up and walk to the I swear I've seen her somewhere. Um, I'm what, you're walking where? I, I I take her to the, we go to the stairwell. Should we just go up to the roof and wait there? Guys? I guess, yeah. Yeah, that sounds like a plan. I don't see why not. Yeah, I guess I immediately kind of just take her, covering, make sure her face isn't really exposed. Uh, uh, okay, as as uh, stealthily as you can, you guys all kind of stand up and, and guide to her to the stairwell like some sort of uh, publicly disgraced celebrity. <laughs> I turn around. Thanks for making my girlfriend feel uncomfortable. <laughs> uh, you guys make it to the stairwell, and you you see the look on on Lily's face is is not good. Uh, maybe this was maybe this was just all for nothing. I is anybody not gonna recognize me? I oh dear. Uh, maybe uh, don't worry. We get you in that worry, helicopter, we get you across the border, and we'll put you down somewhere very, very remote, hopefully, and we can change that face or something. You can have, you're going to have to change that face. Yeah, upside down. Oh. You're going to actually change your face. My bad. Uh, make, me a, make me a conversation check. Me? Shift. Mm. 13. She's she's having a bit of a panic attack. 13? I, I mean, maybe maybe you're right. I oh, I really I don't know if this was the right decision after all. Uh, but the four of you are, are stuck in this uh, stairwell next to the emergency exit. Yo, camera. Do we do we just go up the emergency <laughs> exit out the top? How how long has it been since we talked to to Jack? About an hour. Okay. Wow. What a beast. I, I messaged him to be like ETA on that helicopter. Uh, he texts you back and is like, uh, Bodwell's being a bitch, but uh, should be there soon. Okay. Ish. 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 Cool. Cool. Can, it's, I guess I don't know. Can we, uh, can we stab her with her serotonin needle? Uh, I mean, if you if you want to try to figure out where those are kept, you know what we need. We need like you know that scene in Harry Potter where uh, Hermione casts that spell on Harry Potter's face just to fuck with the the people yeah. trying to identify him. We need that. I, I've never read or seen Harry Potter, so uh, you disappoint. I don't me know what you mean. Good, good for you, Walter. <laughs> Yo, those books are too thick, man. I can't read. Disappointed in you, Walter. Yeah, I'm reading Lord of the... No, the J.K. Rowling's a disgrace now, any days. You know what? I don't give a shit. I love Harry Potter. <laughs> Alright, so you said I had to find out where her, her needles are kept. Well, she usually wears a, a two-piece bikini, so it shouldn't be too hard. Um, But, I mean, we could just wait for this helicopter... Is she, is she more or less coming down now? Uh, or? I mean, she's she's still freaked out, but I mean, she's not like spazzing out, if that's what you mean. We slap the shit out of her. If you want to. I don't, I don't want to. I was joking. Um, but you guys continue to just kind of sit in the. Can I stairwell? Can I kind of yeah. take make like a listen check? I don't know if, how what it would guess you. Yeah, go ahead. And, that's just gonna be another perception roll. Just to see if there's anyone approaching the door or coming from below us. Thirteen. I, I think we just like thirteen. Sorry, what were you saying? Um, I I feel like when we roll perceptions, we should all just do it, just to like, you know. 17. See, look at that. What? From a 13 to a 21. Uh, being being the, techno, the technologically sound individual <laughs> that you are, um, you, you start to pick up something and you hear just kind of like the, the dull buzz of a streaming drone somewhere from above you. Ooh. Oh, shit. All right, guys, bad news. We got a drone in the vicinity. You know, well, what we might have to do is immediately throw an EMP up the top. Yeah, we do still have a couple of those. Yeah. 
Sure. Pip pat poon. <laughs> um, yeah, we can just like wait until we hear the helicopter and then throw the MP out. Oh. Make sure we have. Let's cover Lily's face. Make sure we don't hit the helicopter with the EMP. <laughs> true. That's very true. It's, it's three meters, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we, we should well, be yeah, fine. That's not, yeah, we should be good. But let's make sure we cover Lily's face with yeah. one of the masks. Yeah, yeah, I guess we give Lily one of the belly claws. Yeah. Right, yeah. she, she puts it on, some of her hair kind of sticks out. Aw. Uh, but now she's wearing a beige overcoat and a black balaclava and <laughs> nothing else but a bikini bottom. She's kind of smiling. Um, looks pretty trash. Yeah, I feel like. <laughs> I feel like yeah. Jack's gonna come into this like next and be like, "You guys handled that very poorly." <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna be pissed. This is what happens when you do paperwork, fam. We need you. <laughs> <laughs> We need you as the voice of reason. I'm just shoot, shoot, pew, man. I have logical skills, but I'm also very pussy whipped right now, my guy. I'm not thinking straight. Yeah, my guy's not very smart either. <laughs> uh, as you continue to kind of sit in the stairwell, you know, 15 minutes um, start to pass. With your previous perception checks, um, Lucian, you hear the buzz continue to go on and then um you start to hear kind of soft footsteps coming towards the door <clears throat> fuck so uh we may have a, a an approaching new victim is there what, what type is, is it is it like an automatic door that slides or is it like a push or pull door that's like one of those really shitty um you know stairwell doors okay with like the metal bar opening, you know. Oh, I love those. Do we have? I hate those. Is there something? Why do you hate those? Is there something oh, nearby we could really like put a pipe in between that to like stop them from opening it? We're from a piper. <laughs> you'll you'll want to find a pipe. I mean, or like something to block the door. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> uh, make me a make me a perception oh, check. My God. Please. Whenever somebody says pipe in the campaign. Too easy. Oh my god, no. <laughs> I got you. you I got it. Be... I got the pipe, bro. I mean, this is a stairwell, so it's pretty bare bones, but there is some, like, pipes attached to the sprinkler system. Okay, well, we're not fucking with that. <laughs> you know what? You know what? It might not be them. Let's just chill out, and if it is, we just light them up. Yeah, bro. We got <laughs> just, you, you stand there chilling um and you hear somebody like in mid-conversation as they as the door opens up um and it's it's a man he, he looks at you he's wearing the kind of the smock outfit from the cafe you were just at he he looks at the four of you a little bit wide-eyed um open-mouthed sorry not expecting I, this her girl's just having a, a bad day off. here we're just trying to console her you know yeah bro uh, uh, almost on cue uh Lily Rose starts to like weep into the corner. What a bad thing. Oh, uh, oh, do, uh, do, do you need anything? No, no, no. Nah, bro, go in here. Let's break somewhere else, my guy. We, we uh, just oh. wanted some privacy. Sorry to intrude. No, uh, ex excuse me. And he just kind of closes the door again. Hell yeah. Hey, hey, guys, I think there's something going on in the stairwell. What Fuck, I should have shot him in the head. <laughs> fucking snitch! <laughs> I've got my pistol ready. Oh, shift! Don't forget to. Uh, did you did you ever take the blanks out of your fucking gun? Uh, yeah, I've changed them up by now. Okay. So I was like, I might have to pop this dude, and I don't want him to live. You know, the good thing is, is if these guys come around the corner, I could light them on fire. <laughs> oh, true. <God. laughs> just so <laughs> they, <laughs> they walk around the corner and just get freaking annihilated. See that the the flamethrower has a general surgeon's warning on it that says don't use in confined space. <laughs> Fuck that. We don't care about that. That man sounds like a snee itch. <laughs> For real. I I kind of whisper out the corner of the door. I'm like, stop. Wait. 
Um, but eventually you, you hear hear more footsteps <laughs> outside the door. Um, you know, a little bit of a heavier one. Voldex slams the door shut and presses his body against it. I mean, the door was never open, mm. but okay. <laughs> I press my body against the door. Okay. Um, yeah, you see somebody tries to open, like, Jimmy the, the door handle, uh, and then there's a pause, and then they kind of knock. I excuse me. Nobody's home. Who is it? Uh, I brought some water. Oh. We're not oh. thirsty. Yeah, we're, we're fine. Thank you, though. Okay, you know that you can't have a breakdown in the in the stairwell though people there's foot traffic that needs to get through there there's an elevator there's no fire going on right now please uh, can we just have a few more minutes she's really distraught and we just want some privacy it's really crowded out there and only me persuasion a full deck illusion floss rules fucking persuasion easy oh, people I'm not gonna have. I, I Get the fuck out of here, bro. <laughs> Persuasion. Not, I'm persuaded him out of here with my harsh words. Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad, yeah. That's pretty easy. Yeah, I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna give you a minute or two, but if. You, and with yeah. that, there's just there's not really any sound. It sounds like he's just kind of standing near the door. Oh, what a beast. Alrighty, guys. So we gotta we gotta wrap this up quickly, my man. Um, where is my man Deacon at? Well, he's not coming, but where is? Do, do his we thingy? hear a helicopter at all? Shh! You can't tell him that a helicopter's coming, bro. No, but do we? Yeah, hear you you hear the the buzz of the of the drones outside, Lucian. But um, eventually, shift. You kind of get a text on your phone within the next like minute. Uh, should be there soon. Jack Deacon, man of mystery. <laughs> That's how I'm gonna start signing my text, Jack Deacon, man of mystery, paperwork boy. So, here's the deal, guys. I think we should head to the top, mm -hmm. get away from this guy, and cool, cool. disable the drones before they can see the helicopter. Alrighty. Yeah. Well, I mean, so I we... could click it open and then throw a little, like, slip out the EMP and aid, and then let it go off, getting an E drone nearby, and then we could get out. All that right. sounds good to me. All right, so I'll, I'll climb up to the, the exit, kind of okay. click it open enough that I can slide the EMP nade out, and then kind of close it again, let the EMP nade go off, and then go out. It, that's what I'm doing. Okay, um, as you go ahead and you, you move to just open the latch, um, you, you, you click the bar and open it up, and you um, do see, like, a red light just kind of flash on. Fuck! Um... As you hear somewhere in the building, something kind of start to sound off very loudly. Um, but you uh -oh. slip the grenade in and close it in. There's a huge um, electrical blast sound as the whatever drone was out there just kind of falls and clunks against the roof. All right, I open it and I immediately just like get on the top and put my hand down and be like, get up here now. We follow. Uh, yeah. I mean, you guys all uh, climb up the maintenance hatches as alarms to kind of start to go off. Um, yeah. Full deck, that man is kind of trying to open that door again. Okay, well, I'm just going to keep pressed against the door. I'm just going to yell okay. at you guys. Um, just let me know when I can get off of this, and I'll, I'll sprint up there. All right. <laughs> all right. You, all, you, you leave Voldeck behind the valiant man that he is <laughs> as you guys go up through the maintenance hatch. I mean, with it open, I'd be like, "Get up here, Voldig." Uh, okay, we can because we can I leave the door and start sprinting up. Yeah, we can literally just kick that dude if he tries to follow us. I mean, we can. Yeah, it's a maiden hatch. We could like sit on it. Yeah. All right. I leave the door and I sprint up there. Okay. Um, yeah. As you as you make it like halfway up the hatch, you see the door opens and and the one of the the armored men kind of looks in and he just watches you, basically dashing up the maintenance hatch. Um, and he looks just more than a little bit surprised, and he's like, I don't think you're supposed to do that. I don't think you're supposed to get in my business, and I flip him off and close the hatch. <laughs> Alright. Um, what a you man. guys, on top of the oh, Space goodbye. Needle, 
I'm gonna play Heart of the City again. You know, this is a very like showy way of getting her out of the country. Honestly. Yeah, uh, yeah, you, you, so on t you guys are on top of the Space Needle. You see in the distance the helicopter slowly making its way towards the Space Needle. Voldek, there is thumping coming from the maintenance hatch that you're standing on top of. Alright guys, we don't have much time here. Like, is the helicopter- yeah, sorry, is the helicopter in sight? It, yes. It's it's coming all the way from from Jack Deacon's own business, so it's a little bit away. But you can see it. We literally could have just waited at Griffin Corp. We were just gonna do this. <laughs> yeah, honestly. You hear the sirens going off beneath you, as you hear like sounds of shouting and talking coming direct directly below your feet from the terrace below. <laughs> cool. cool. <laughs> this is such a botched job. <laughs> <laughs> You're a very low. Uh, you're very bad at this. <laughs> oh, very low-sounding kind of electrical buzz. Bro, honestly, just give me a job that requires shooting people. As <laughs> yeah. you can hear slowly creeping up around the sides of the Space Needle. EMP nades, EMP nades! <laughs> start to kind of peek up over the edge. You guys need to throw your EMP nades, I'm out. Right. You see that there's, there's, there's at least right now four different drones kind of start to make peek their way up over the uh, top of the space needle. Cool. Are they I... all grouped or are they? No, they're they're spread out pretty evenly. All right. Well, I okay. The ones they don't throw yeah, their I'm EMP shooting. nades at, I'm shooting. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I I'm just gonna shoot them all. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, he said, "Fuck it." All right, you Fuck. start blasting. So if I could have you people, um. Actually, Actually, I think we're going to make an initiative check if we're going to start shooting. So go to make me initiative. Uh, where's oh, hold on. I need to... I have a... No! My... What does my reflex booster give me? Plus three? Plus three. Okay, yeah, so that's... That's an 18 in 18. My, my Wait, luck has run out on good rolls, guys. You have a seven? Six. Six. What did I so roll? still better than, than Lucian. Yeah, it looks like I was still fucking last. <laughs> Damn. No, I didn't even plan on shooting these things. I don't even think I brought my gun with me. <laughs> All I have is the nades. And the sword, probably. <laughs> oh, you oh, see this? The sword always stays with me, bro. Lucian just starts cutting these things in half. Yeah, them in All right, so, so going first, um, shift. You see that there's there's four drones that are starting to, to focus in on you from the edge of the space needle. Go ahead and um, make your attack. Okay. Twenty-two. Uh, yeah, that hits. <laughs> um, Seven. Uh, I'm doing a triple round burst with this. So. Oh, a triple round burst. Yeah. Um, then let me check the rules really quickly. Triple round burst. This is um, 26 to 50 meters. So, in that case, one bolt's going to hit. Okay. Buzz 7 damage. Uh, yeah, so you go ahead and you, you burst fire at them, and you, you hit one, and it... Um, you know, you hear the camera shattering as it, as it collapses and rolls off the top of the building. Alright. Uh, I mean, yeah. On Twitch. Voldek, uh, you see him just shoot that one out, and now you, you whip up your rifle as you see others. Yeah. I'm gonna start firing. Pew pew. Go for it. What do I, what do I roll? Marksmanship? Marksmanship. We'll make your attack roll. Shit. 29. Yeah. Very um, impressive. And... Bam. Holy shit, what? You just made a second attack roll. <laughs> no, you, wait, what? Well, yeah, oh, I think one, you made a second wait, attack. One, one second, one second. <laughs> oh, melee attack! One second, sorry. Um, there we go. One second. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I need you to roll. You'll see on the, on the attacks there's attack and damage. Yes. I need you to roll damage. 
There we go. There we go. You you see as as one <laughs> bolt goes goes straight through a drone and it just with kind of an electric buzz just tumbles off. Um, Lucian, it's your turn. <laughs> Lord, what, what are we doing? I do. I, I run up to it with my cyber katana. Okay, you, you, so you run up right to the very edge of the space needle. <laughs> <laughs> you you, you buy, dude, oh to buy. Don't worry, bro. I'm used to this. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not. Um, Do I even hit? Oh, they, they have to make a evasion roll in order to get hit by melee, so hold on a second. Okay. Well, let's hope critical uh, failure, bro. Add character... <laughs> A character drone. Do not, do not, do not roll critical failure. No, no, no. They need to. Yeah, I want them to roll critical failure. I've already rolled really little. Yeah. So they just had to beat that in an invasion, and they're very small, so it's probably gonna happen. Um, <laughs> it is pretty hard to uh to hit them. This is why you bring your pistols, kids. Yeah. My cyber katana. It makes me look cool, but I'm not very used to using it. That's very weird. Weird. Making a character sheet for a drone is pretty weird. <laughs> okay. This is such tense music critical for this. Critical failure, critical failure. Uh, this is evasion. <laughs> no, <laughs> but they still pass. <laughs> uh, no. Too bad. You just go ahead and you run up to the very edge of the of the space needle and, and slash at it with your fancy looking katana uh, and just kind of whiff as it buzzes out of your way. Um, you see, right, you right. see that the the two surviving drones kind of come up onto the space needle and hover a little bit in midair uh, as they get a little bit closer, and this kind of infernal buzzing just kind of keeps creeping up as below your feet, Voldek, you hear a very angry barking voice. Hey, open up the door! Here, one second, guys. Oh. But Voldek says nothing as he continues to stand there very valiantly. You know what we could do is, like, we could prop open the door and I could just flame down. Wait, would you say that these two remaining drones are within three three meters? Can I throw my, my MP nade? Uh -oh. So I, I well, bang down on the on the grate. I say, hey, fuck you guy. I'm shitting okay. up here. <laughs> uh go ahead and make me we're gonna make an opposed athletics check on either side of this door here. Fuck. <laughs> As they try to break it open. Okay. Will he outpower you? Oh no! Yeah, no! Why is there so many failures? Uh, what did I say was oh. gonna be? Athletics? Yeah. yeah. Oh god. I was, I was, I was, oh, god. oh no! Twitch mud. No! Um, yeah, you, you're here you, with a very loud bump. Uh, the door, like, kind of pushes up against you and you trip and fall down. Um, they're not no open problems, yet, but you're... You're no longer on it, um, and you see you see more drones start to kind of creep up around the edge as we go back to the top of the initiative order with with uh, Ethan. Um, is there how close is the helicopter at this point? Uh, you can see, you know, it's about four to five rounds away. Four to five rounds. Okay. Okay. <laughs> well, as soon as I see um, Voldek collapse and and fall off. I go I, I switch weapons to my flamethrower. Um oh my god. <laughs> well we gotta Oh just scorch it. Scorch it and make it too hot for them to touch. I mean I guess I could do that. I was gonna open it and burn them, but <laughs> Oh yeah, that's even better. Okay. Um I flip open the hatch and just spray the flamethrower down the hole. <laughs> yeah, you see you, you see the first in the face of one of these these masked individuals. Uh, you see the Twitch model logo, and you just rip flame down that shoots with your flamethrower. Go and make me that attack. <laughs> He's just some dude trying to do his job. 25, bro. Oh my god! 
Get that guy roll damage. <laughs> Fucking annihilated. Like, bro, I, I actually just brought water for you guys. I was trying to see if she was okay. 14. 14 points of oh, damage. Okay. You just hear like an an inhuman degree of just screaming <laughs> as chemical flames are shot into the hatch before oh. Ethan just slams oh, it. Oh. It's, it's just you're right, Walter. It's just like the worker guy. Like, hey, let's try to see if you guys are all right. He has like snacks and hot dogs ready. What <laughs> 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 is that? I mean, might have been behind the other guy. You didn't look. <laughs> Doesn't matter now. Snitch. Snitch is getting burned. Yeah. You close the hatch again, and you you, you hear that the God. you hear that the screaming and shouting from the from the terrace below you guys has has picked up. It's gone from confusion to legitimate panic. <laughs> then we're gonna be on the news. <laughs> This is supposed to be such a simple job. Oh my god, dude. Wait, uh, everybody thought we were in the, like, the emergency exit, though. Yeah. Well, that's, I mean, uh, oh my god. It's my turn. It's your I, turn I, in the initiative order. You see that there's the there's the two that are kind of like a lot closer to you guys, and then four mm. more peeking up over <laughs> the edges. Okay, um... Shit. I want to keep firing at these drones, but would I be able to hit multiple with the grenade? Potentially. Potentially. Depends on how good of an athletics check you make throwing it. Oh, no. Uh, let me check. Um, what's my athletics? What? Fuck. <laughs> um, I at, least, I at least should try. I should try. You should indeed try. However... Yeah. You only have one grenade, so, uh... Make it count? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna throw the grenade. Try and hit two of them. Ooh. What should I roll? Athletics. Ooh. Hey, big nice. Not, not bad. Uh, you go ahead and you, you throw it kind of near the edge. You let it kind of roll down the, the sloped surface of the roof of the Space Needle, and it kind of makes it to the edge before blasting off. Um, you, you see two of the drones just immediately get annihilated, as well as several people um, from the terrace below just kind of scream out in pain. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh. <laughs> you got probably some cybernetics in there, huh? Alright. Oh, well. Yo, we're gonna... a, few, a few casualties don't mean anything. Yeah, you see electric kind of sparks kind of ripple through the, the, the metal surface of the space needle, but otherwise, I mean, you've taken down two of them. Nice. That's so, all um, L Lucian, it's your turn. All right, I'm gonna also attempt to throw my uh, my grenade. How many are left? Well, there there's like still four. I think you have no? the last one. It's like six, right? How many did he just take out? Two. Shift Shift used both his. Nate just used his, and you have the last one. Um, and no, I mean I know we have one grenade. We have a regular grenade still, or no? We have the front one. Uh, there there's currently four drones. Two of which are the ones pretty close to you, and then two that are still coming from the edge. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna attempt to throw my grenade, my my remaining grenade at this these two that are right in front of me. Oh, okay. Do I have to roll athletics for that, or are they just close enough where I can just say fuck it? Uh, it's athletics unless you want to just hold it while it explodes. Oh, that would take my eye out. I'm gonna I'm gonna. Right. Now that's that's good enough. You go ahead and you, you kind of just like toss it up into the air directly vertical above you um, to get the drones that are now at this point kind of out of range of your glowing sword. Um, and there's a huge burst like a firework above your heads as two of the drones just clatter and slam into the metal surface of the roof. Clank. <clears throat> nice. Uh, but nicely done. Um you see kind of Lily Rose is just kind of on her knees, just watching everything unfold as Where she belongs. Two... Huh? Where she belongs. Sure. <laughs> um, but as just the, the buzz starts to kind of drown out any sense of, of your communications or ability to hear um, between that and the screaming below, as you see kind of more buzz of more of these infernal 
purple drones peek up over the edge Apparently. as they seem to be scaling this tower. Jeez. Ethan, what are you going to do about it? Um, what am I going to do about it? Um, just a question about triple round burst. So is the yes. ruling is I can I have to use the triple round burst on one target or can I spread the three bullets out or is that just way too OP? I think I'll target. I think I'll target. Okay, fair enough. Um <clears throat> Alright, um I take I aim at the closest drone to me and shoot at it. Okay, are you doing triple round burst or normal? Uh triple round burst. Okay, the ones that are close to you are going to be a lot easier to hit with the burst as they're 0 to 12 meters away. 20. Yeah, I'll, you go ahead and roll damage three times. Nope, that last one doesn't count. <laughs> I mean, 25 damage, yeah, you, you see Lilla Gross kind of lets out a shriek as, as Shift, you just unload into this drone right above you as just shredding it, and as metal shrapnel and bullet casings fall to the ground. Alright, um... Uh, with my movement, I'm gonna position myself kind of in front of Lily, just so, like, the cameras can't get a good view of her. Um... Sure, you, yeah, you block, like, a few of them. It's pretty difficult, what with yeah. the, you know, curvature of the roof, but you try. And also, there's... She has a mask on. Yeah, I know, but I just want to block her, like, front of her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... Voldek, it's your turn. Bro, if these guys what open I, up that hatch, they're getting another load of flamethrower. <laughs> if they're stupid enough to do um, so. What's around me? Uh, the hatch, which has been deathly silent. One drone. Uh, sorry. Um, <clears throat> took out the two, took out the other two, took out one more. Uh, one drone that is kind of making its way a lot closer to you, and then four more at the edge. Alright, I'll go for the closer drone. Okay. Yeah. That, that definitely hits. Uh, yeah. uh, you go out and you, you shoot the drone, clipping it through the, the kind of the uh, propeller as it falls. Uh, still operating, but no longer able to move, just kind of fixed on all four of you. Ooh, I don't like that. Because it just sits it? there. What? Can I kick it away? <laughs> uh, yeah, you can run up and kick it, I'm sure, if you want to. Uh, I'll go kick it. Okay. okay. You kick it off the terrace, and it, you can see it fall the many, many stories below, down down to the earth, where people are going about their daily business. <laughs> Bro, we've yeah. killed so many people. Oh my god. <laughs> like, well, as, as, you, as you look over the side of the Space Needle, you see two things. Uh, you see the, the shouting, panicking crowd, most of which have their phones out, kind of craning over the terrace to look up at what's going on. <laughs> Why did we come to a public place? <laughs> Secondly, back to the base. You see dozens of these drones just oh, vertically God. climbing up <laughs> towards you. Guys, <laughs> how many more turns until right, this fucking copter gets here? Oh my God! You see the copter is slowly but surely making its way <laughs> to help you. Oh my God! Lucian. All right, we just keep shooting, I guess. Yeah, I guess. Lucian, what do you want to do? <laughs> All right, how many drones are left? Well, besides the dozens that are coming for us. Four. Uh, Sam, what should we do? <laughs> what should I do? I think we're just we just gotta keep fighting. Why didn't you bring a bloody pistol or something? Cause I'm stupid. <laughs> I didn't think this would be very combat heavy. No, I think you have a sword. Yeah. You can chuck it. I'm not gonna chuck my sword, bro. I just bought this sword. I continue slashing. I will hit somebody. At least you know, you, could, you could wait at the edge and wait for one of them to get close and just slash it. Yeah. 
I do that. Alright, yeah, you will go walk over to the edge and you see the drone just barely kind of coming up to it, and you meet it with your sword. Kasloosh. Do I have to roll damage for it? You have to roll attack. Oh, sorry. Yeah, you have to roll attack. Okay. Please don't <laughs> Again! <laughs> Jesus. Jesus Christ. <laughs> You, you see the drone just Bro, kind of just misses. want my pistol for the next year. <laughs> yeah, give him your pistol. Give as, him your as, pistol. As, as you, you're leaning over the edge of the thing, trying to wave your sword at the drone, you see <laughs> all the people blow just a flurry of people taking photographs of you. Oh my god. <laughs> you're, we have our masks yeah, yeah, on. Don't worry, I have my ball club on, bro. I might have to replace this sword, though, because I think I'm probably the only one in town with it. <laughs> the one you got at the bargain then. Yeah. Um, you see as as the four drones um, in between rounds here just kind of it, it just flies kind of right past you, Lucian, <laughs> if you miss it. Um as, trash. As, as they as the four of them just kind of make their beeline right towards um the the, the masked <laughs> woman standing there. Um Ethan. There's four drones honing in on poor old Lily Rose. Oh, one of them's getting. What one? are you gonna do? Okay, how how like like are they like close to me? or Are they like flying above me? They're 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 at about head level basically. All right, I'm gonna have my gun put away and have my big nux kind of not ex like activate my big nux in my fist and go to punch one of them like right in the camera. Oh, I'm in. <clears throat> okay. Go for it. Um, hold on. The fist. Oh, wait. Hold on, wait. Is that the right thing? Fist. Yeah. Fist. Oh, I was gonna... I, I meant to do big nucks, but whatever. I, I think it's the same role. Yeah. Um, big nucks. So, 13 hit? Oh, fuck. Jeez. Uh, mm. Apparently not. All right. Well, we're gonna, t we're, gonna t we're taking another swing with that big nux. All right, but I'll actually roll big nux for it. Then. What the fuck, man? Oh, <laughs> it's the same. Bro, these these drones are hacking. Oh bro. my god. Bro, bro. Um, hold on, wait, wait. It's, it's really hard to to beat some to just punch something that just kind of bobs and weaves through the air. You like? You I could throw my luck. Points. I could have thrown my luck points into that. You you throw some like glancing blows in there, but because like the drone suspended in midair, it just kind of brushes it off. God damn it! I uh, I guess I just like move back to Lily and just like push her down so like sh she's like kind of <laughs> like you know covered by like like my body essentially. Jesus. Okay. Well, we're trying to protect her, right? Full deck. Just start shooting, bro. <laughs> what do you? How are you gonna help? <laughs> Fucking God! What do I even do? Just shoot! Just shoot! Okay. Can you get a collateral, yeah. please? At this point, we're just gonna waste bullets until the helicopter gets here. Yeah. Oh my man! Yeah, solid. You go, you go ahead and you 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 shoot one of the the four that's getting closer, and you just kind of obliterate it. There's not much left of it as it rains onto the ceiling. Why are you even bothered shooting these drones? <laughs> They're just fucking fodder. That's how drones are. Do they, do they have any, like, weapons on them, or are they just recording us? Like, everybody already knows we're here. They're basically- they're just recording you. I mean, their fans could probably hurt you if you stuck your finger in them. You got a point there, we could just wait. Do we have to attack them? Uh -oh. Lucian, what do you want to do? You're still standing at the edge, and there's there's <laughs> more creeping up over it. Uh. Do you want to just use my pistol, man? Yeah, bro. Toss that gen over. I'm not gonna toss it to you. <laughs> I want to toss it. It's gonna be an athletic <laughs> check. Yeah. All right, I walk over and I grab the pistol out of your hand very carefully. <laughs> you better not fucking drop it. You guys remember those bear traps in D&D? God damn it, yeah, because I stepped in like three of them. 
All right. Wait, can I can I grab the pistol and make an attack roll in the same in the same turn? Yeah, I'll allow it. You just he, he hands it to you safety off like he shouldn't, and you whip around. Nice. nice. All right, I pop I pop a drone. Oh nice. You should pop a drone. Yeah, pop a drone. Um. These drones are hacking though. I don't know, man. Uh, zero to twelve meters. Would you like to use any luck points? Nah, fam. I believe in the heart of the cards. Okay, well, the zero, 0 to 12 meters for pistol DC is 15, so you you uh, fire blindly. And, uh, oh, you could have used one, bro! Come on! <laughs> Luck, oh, yeah, I know. Lux exists for a reason. I believed in the heart of the cards, man. As, as you fire uh, at these drones that just kind of single-mindedly, single-purposely just kind of go on past you... Um, <laughs> You, you see the ones that I'm, have, I'm have made to shoot, it pass twice just start to kind of coalesce and collect right above um, Lily Rose as Shift, you do your best to kind of cover her with your body. Can you just flamethrower these things, bro? They're all oh, right yeah, there yeah, on yeah. you, they're, they're pretty close to me. I guess I could try that. But yeah, you see the, the four drones are just kind of peering insistently, just staring saying nothing and just filming down at you all. Um, <laughs> what do you want to do, Ethan? Um, are, are they... Yeah, the fucking kinda... anxiety is gonna <laughs> shoot the roof. Um, like, like uh, Cameron had suggested, like, are they all within a radius that my flamethrower could hit all of them? Um, or some of them? I'm gonna say, I'm, I'll say yes. I'll say yes for this one. Right. Uh, there's, there's three that made it all the way to you and staring right at Lily Rose, and then there's four more that are halfway there and four more at the edge. Oh my god, okay, yeah, I'm gonna flamethrower him. 23. Okay. Uh, yes, that hits. Go ahead and, and roll damage. 18. I'll say the damage is, like, distributed. 18. 18 divided by 3 is, is uh, 6. Um, so with 6 damage, you torch all of them, and they're, they're motors immediately just fry out and they thunk onto the roof in different directions still operational and filming but not staring at you all right all right kick them off the edge <laughs> yeah i mean right. I'll, I'll kick one of them i don't know if i could oh, kick okay. all three of them all off the edge. probably just hit people in the head <laughs> yeah yeah you know what yeah i'll leave i'll let them like burn essentially okay yeah, they're they're they are on fire Oh yeah. Um, sorry. Like also, turn. how many more turns until that helicopter gets here? Um, I think two. Okay. Nice, nice. Very good. We're almost there. We're in the end game now. Hold up, it's your turn. Um, fuck. What can I even do? Like, ow, fuck. Let's scab him. Um, I mean, I guess, I don't know. <laughs> Just shoot! We have to shoot. That's our only option at the moment. Alright, shoot! <laughs> I, I don't really know if we can do okay. anything else. Um, yeah. <laughs> Dear oh Dear my god. <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> You see, you see every single shot as as Voldek has basically been shooting just constantly over and over again into the mass of drones. Just they they fall from the sky every single time, like headshot after headshot on these drones. Oh, headshot! <laughs> yeah, as another one just disintegrates. Lucian, what are you gonna do? How many are there left? There. I'm assuming you were shooting one of the closer ones, Voldek. So there's there's three pretty close, and then there's four more further away. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pop one. Hopefully, hopefully for real this time. I just gotta keep shooting, man. Yeah. I have no other options. Oh. That I hits. Think I, yeah, thank God. Wasn't real damage. <laughs> you know what? 
You, you, you wing one, you shoot like the connecting joint between it and the propeller, and it just kind of buzzes onto the ground, camera face down. Really nice. I finally hit one good. Do you want to kick it? No, I, I, I'm not going to get anybody down there anymore. Okay. Um, you see, you see as, as two more of the drones um, get right up in your guys' faces, uh, Lily Rose kind of assesses herself and stands up. Um, you see she kind of looks at the drones and looks at all of you guys doing your best. And she kind of sighs. Don't you dare give up. She jumps off the fucking space. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, this sounds like a suicide situation. <laughs> Don't you dare give up, Lily. I got. Kinda... She reaches up and she takes the balaclava. No, off. hold on. No! no, I. You know what? Wait. Uh, there's no reactions in this game. No. I'm trying to talk to her. <laughs> I'm trying to talk to her while she's doing. Can I persuade? <laughs> you can talk as an incidental. As she is trying to do it, be like, "Don't do it, please." That helicopter is almost here. Please roll me persuasion with under stress or attack. Fuck my. Ignore my persuasion. Fourteen. No, you know what? No, 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 no. <laughs> Screw that. Fourteen. Um. Oh. Points. I'm putting oh. luck point. Oh my god. Hmm, how many points of luck do I want to put in this? How many points do I have? I'm putting seven points of luck into it. Seven points of luck? Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Our last ditch effort, like, no! Yeah, so 21. It's all for nothing if you do this. Oh my goodness. Okay, one, one moment. Hold on a second. I need, I'm going to check something. <laughs> Why was not wait? ready for us to just be like, no. <laughs> no. Why would you wait all the way until the, the helicopter is here just to say, you know what, never mind. <laughs> Pro Lily, I, I like you in this east waking second. You you played with Lily Rose with, with I don't know, blood in your throat. <laughs> as you as you beg her to, to, to not reveal herself. Yeah. Um, and she, she kind of looks at the helicopter a ways away, um, it's like and looks at all the drones. What? It's like one turn away, right? Yeah, it's pretty close. Um, yeah, but I mean, she doesn't take off that mask. Kind of under my breath, I'm like, thank, thank you, God. thank you. Uh, Ethan, it's your turn. Um... <laughs> can can I hold my action and wait until the drones get close enough to me? I could spray them with the flamethrower. Well, there there's two of them already in your face. Oh yeah, I spray two of them with the flamethrower. Wow. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that hits. Six damage each, I guess. <clears throat> yeah, they they both are. They both have camera. The the floor is getting littered with these ones that have their cameras on in these fixed positions. Um, getting nice, you know, up shots at all of you. Well, I mean, if there's any facing me, I kick them away from me, like you know, away from facing me. Okay. We got our ball clavas on anyway. Yeah. yeah. Chilling. Um, who who gave their ball clava to Lily Rose? Damn, I believed it was just. Yeah, I I don't have my face mask on. That's fine. I don't give a shit. Um, your shift is too cool. He, he, he's known around the world anyway. But it's deck. It's your turn. Um, there's still some uh, some bad boyos, right? Yes, you also hear uh, kind of a thump coming from that maintenance hatch. Alright, this bitch. I'm gonna stomp my foot on the maintenance hatch. Okay, let's make athletics checks. Oh, <laughs> you, yo, bro, you should have done it. Oh, just okay. waited till he opened it, blew his head off. Yeah, probably a good idea, but it's okay. I have to keep switching through character sheets. Yeah, I like that it switches to the the picture of the armored man. 
Oof. Oof. You get you 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 as you stomp down. There's kind of a backlash as as the guy pushes up and, and knocks you off of it, stumbling you backwards. Say move, bitch! I'm coming up here. Um. But you still have, I mean, you still have your action and movement. What do you want to do? Um. Well, I guess I'll just aim my rifle at, at the at whoever's coming up. Oh, okay. Sounds sounds good. Uh, um, is it is it one of the big bad boyos, or is it just the guy that was trying to give us water? Uh, you're not sure, but I mean, they're trying to open up that hatch. Aren't they the okay. same? Per- they're, they're the same person, right? No. No, the one that was trying to open up the hatch before is one of the Twitch mods. <laughs> and he got flamed. Um, Why is he still trying to come up here, bro? He, he, he just got off a of fire if he's not still on fire. Hear, hear me out, it could be somebody else. Yeah. Lucian, what do what you want to do? Uh, I mean, I guess I'll, I guess I'll give, give full deck back up if we're training our weapons on the person that's not a drone. Yeah, the both of you just train your weapons on the maintenance hatch. Okay, sounds good. You both just kind of have your weapons leveled at that god-blasted hatch. Um, as you can start to hear the helicopters um, sound behind you. We're in the game now, boys. We're almost there. Uh, as you two have your, your weapons pointed at the latch, you see it kind of um, creaks and then busts open as you, you see the helmeted mask of a Twitch mod kind of pop out weapon at the ready. So if both of you want to make your attack... What? Headshot. Yeah, it's going to be headshots. Right now. Go ahead and roll a headshot. Um, marksman. Only one from my roll. You fucking suck, Lucian. Tragic. <laughs> Only a one subtracted from uh, my roll. This is, this, is cool. zero, this is zero to 12 meters. Um... Which for a sniper rifle? You have any luck points, bro? Would anybody like to use your luck points? What do I need to hit? I mean, I can't stop you from checking the custom rules, but I'll tell you since it's public education, uh, public information, the the DC for a sniper rifle for zero to twelve is twenty five meters or twenty five DC. <laughs> no. uh, if only I had my pistol. <laughs> God damn Don't worry, it. I'll flame the shit out of him. Uh, you guys yeah. both both just unleash into this this uh, Twitch mod, but both of your bolts just kind of bounce off of his helmet as he as he breaches through that door and comes up onto the roof. Uh, he, he he whips out a, a, a rifle and, and points it at the closest person. Ah. Get on the ground! No! <laughs> the ground... I don't like the ground. Um, Ethan, it's your turn. All right, help us. <laughs> um, how close is this Save guy to me? How close, bro? Tom, how what? close is he to me? Uh, you're not near the Mason's hatch, so you're. I'm gonna say 13 to 25 meters away. All right. Um, and is this the guy flame before? Like, does he have scorch marks on him? No, this is a different guy. Um, okay, I... Not that you look that closely at the last yeah, guy. Yeah, but... yeah, but I just want to see if he had scor- scorch marks on him. I guess I move closer to him, and I as I aim at him, be like, unless you want to fucking be a crispy son of a bitch, put down your fucking weapon. You're doing a face down? Mm-hmm. All right. Um... um... Where's the face down button? Where you think it is. Oh, sorry, it's in actions. Okay, here we go. Face down. Ooh. Oh. Uh, you see, you see his he he kind of shifts a little bit, um, and his his gun wavers a little bit, but he just doesn't say anything as he continues pointing it at your friend. Um, as this is literally his job, and he can't afford to back down. All right, well, he's gonna get a load of flamethrower. All right, go for it. The DC, this uh, he's going to try to evade, of course, okay. uh, but he will have that minus three. So it's a... yes. 
Get fucked. Yeah. Go ahead and roll damage. Seven. Get fucked. <laughs> Seventeen damage. Oh my goodness. Um. <laughs> Somebody throw in that sound of the like, whatever like Ewok or whatever in Star Wars. It's like. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you you see he 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 screams um, as you've just basically given him a serious wound as he's he's not doing very well right I'm now. I'm just imagining that um, scene from Lord of the Rings when the steward of Gondor is like fucking on fire, jumping off minister. <laughs> uh. No, you you can see he's he's kind of. I mean, if you could see under his his mask, he's baring his teeth as he grips his his rifle with white knuckles as he he's burning. All right. Jesus, this guy's fucking hardcore. Mm. Um, Voldek, what do you want to do? Well, can I have, uh, Camerahead give me my pistol? Well, you could just move backwards. I could. Can I do a sick roll? If you don't want to make an athletics check on this curve, I don't want to make an athletic <laughs> check. But he just slips and falls to his death. You can walk like a normal person. <laughs> I will walk like a boring normal person. <laughs> I don't, you can hey. roll. No, I don't want to. <laughs> Full deck rolls off. I don't. The fucking side of it. I don't want to risk a critical failure and just roll off this fucking building. Oh yeah, that would kill uh, you. And as you as you go ahead and you walk back, you see Lily Rose just kind of standing there, like looking at the whole everything that's just going on, <laughs> and she's just distraught. Probably she's pretty distraught. You she she's she's. She doesn't know what to do. Listen, Lily. Or, listen! I don't want to say her name. Uh. Young maiden! <laughs> young. All will be okay! <laughs> Watch as I get this sick headshot and know that it is for your safety. Uh, okay. if, if you do see that there's, like, six drones, like, right above you watching this sick headshot. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yeah! Watch these, you Twitch streaming assholes! Oh my god! Oh my god! A body shot or a headshot? I have the. Uh, oh wait, one second. The thing is covering. Um, here, one second. Why don't you just minus six from that for the headshot? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's still thirty-two, which it definitely hits. So go ahead and roll damage. <laughs> yeah. Go ro 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 roll damage twice. Damage. Oh. Oh. Damage. <laughs> Twenty. What is that, 22? Yeah, 22 damage. Uh, minus his armor. Um, yeah, that's that's five damage as it gets. As you see his 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 helmet, you just go ahead and you shoot him right in the, the head. And he's on fire. Um, but you shoot him right in the head as, as half of his helmet basically comes off with the side of his face. Boom, headshot! Uh, is he dead? Yeah, he staggers. No, he's still alive. His helmet saved his life. Oh, dead. Oh, what the fuck? This dude uh, is badass. No, he's just wearing he's just wearing a Kevlar helmet. No, nah, bro, everybody's cheating in this in this this go around. Exactly. Yeah, you know, he has he has he has pretty pretty fucking awesome armor. Um, being a Twitch mod, you get those kind of benefits. True. Don't want to end up like Uvu. He is very close to death, though. Um, Lucian, what do you want to do? Him. I'm gonna whack him with my sword. Yeah, better. No! <laughs> Alright, you run up and whack him. <laughs> we already have fucked up so many times. <laughs> no, this is gonna Why be. Why would you go for the sword when I gave you my pistol? Because you, you, you took your pistol back, bro. No, I, I didn't. Make me that attack roll. Oh, yeah, no, you were going to, but you didn't. <laughs> yeah, I would have had to, like, move towards you and shit and use my action. It's okay, bro. I believe in myself. Hey! <laughs> put, 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 put all your luck points in it, too. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you, see, you see this man, even with his, like, vision obscured with blood and, like, that being on fire, fire he just kind of sidesteps and you come at him with the sword. He's hacking, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro, he's got, like, some kind of mod on. He's got an aimbot. Well, he's pretty... He can, read, he can read all of my movements. All of the drones are connected to him, so he has constant vision on me. 
Yo, that make that would make sense. Yeah, bro, he's like pain, bro. They're all connected. They share sight. Bro. <laughs> oh my god, what are we doing? Well, he's he's probably not gonna <laughs> live much longer because he takes in the face of this god. <laughs> he takes one d six right at the end of his turn, right, from being on fire. At the end of his turn, yeah. He, which right. might kill him, honestly, because since it goes through armor. Okay. Um, but yeah, you see, you see the the Twitch mod there. Um, not really wanting to be engaged with the man who burned him is going to go ahead and um, move around the ceiling, kind of putting himself between the helicopter that's nearly here and the three of you. Oh, what a um, and and as he moves that way, he's going to go ahead and, and shoot at you, Voldex, since you're standing right next to Lily. Um. One second. Okay, sorry, I'm making helicopter noises. <laughs> um, yeah, you see, he he pulls from his waist. He pulls a, a very massive looking pistol. Um, oh my god! That he points at you. Fuck. It's a thirteen. Mama. Not super great. You can either evade or you can put it to the DC. Um. Um. This is where we 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 think about what the DC could be for a pistol at this range. Yeah, I'm gonna evade. Okay. Um like was he far away from Boldeck? No, he was he was coming up close. Oh, okay, okay. It's not letting Don't forget to take the modifier off if you have it on. You're right. Oh my okay, wait, what oh. Lord. wait, hold up. Hold up. Okay, is it thirteen? You, you, made it. you just you barely you feel the bullet brush against your face. It grazes um, your nuts. Holy shit. Yeah. Um you Ooh, see man. you see that the entire basically roof of this space needle is just covered in kind of a buzzing mass of black drones uh watching this fight as this near death uh oh twitch mod fights to save the the poor streamer from her kidnappers um, does the 1d well, 1d6 kill him oh do they know that it's her yeah uh, he takes six points of damage uh oh, you see he at this point uh kind of falls to one knee as he one more shot would basically just kill him um as he's just kind of yeah no no longer able to move um can I finally stab him so I can The, dro the drones, having surrounded Lily now for a while, are going to make some perception checks, though. This job went so south so fast. <laughs> <laughs> no, we did not, Dude, we did not do this very well. Dude, Matt's going to listen back to this, and he's going to be like, you guys were so stupid. Why the fuck <laughs> did you do anything? You should have just... I don't think about how many drones there are. One, two, three... <laughs> He's gonna be like, bro, you should have just shot her if you were gonna do this. Yeah, we should have just killed her. <laughs> so like, like, why not just end her misery? Yeah. So give her pocket change. I doubt she's gonna pay us very much for this botched job anyway. <laughs> Perception. I honestly think you probably lost money buying that flamethrower because <laughs> you're not Yo, gonna get paid. Back. <laughs> you know what? It's okay. It's a dope ass weapon. I like it. Yeah, it's True. honestly doing its pretty okay, well. Okay, Tom just hacked. Do you see these rules? <laughs> <laughs> Tom, you're a fucking hacker, bro. How am I hacker? I just roll. How do you get that? Like, not a single roll below fucking seventeen. God damn it. No. They probably have really good perception yeah, stats. Probably... You can, you can, you guys know that if you hover over it, you can see what the the role no, is, no, right? We'll just say you're hacking to make us feel better. Okay. <laughs> um, but Hacker. you do see, you do see all the drones just kind of bots. stare at at Lily Rose as, as it, it's pretty obvious at this point with what's going on in the parking lot. You know, with the with the f fire and the destroyed drones down there and everything that's going on. You, you, it dawns on you a little bit that that people know who this is. Well, we're getting her out of here regardless. Uh, but yeah, you, <laughs> right, you see the... Make the decision. Do you want to die or do you want to go somewhere else? <laughs> do you say that to her? <laughs> yes. Uh, you see the helicopter there with the single Twitch mod kind of guarding the way. Um, 
Lily Rose just kind of standing there starts making her way towards uh, the edge of the roof. <laughs> no! Why did you say this? Nate, I put all my luck points really? Nate, I put all my luck points into convincing her to not give herself up. You asshole. Oh, shit. Oh, you no, asshole. Oh, shit. I forgot about you that. You asshole. About oh this. my god. Turn around. Okay. She, she, she makes her way to the edge of the <laughs> What are you, what are you doing? No, we're not going to looks pain. down at the we're massive gonna... crowd Lily, looking stop. back up at her. Can I? Taking Lily, pictures. And looking at what's going on as she looks down at them. And she turns. <laughs> Nate, I hate you! Stop! Stop! In her Stop face. Stop! And the three of you standing Think about there. what you're doing. We can get you out of here. We worked so hard. You can you please, can Lily! The, the tears through her balaclava. As she just kind of looks at everything and all the shouting and the buzzing. And the pain and the misery. Can, <laughs> is there, and I run the, is there any way? Is her. there any way with my with, motion, with my reflex modifier, I can do something? Yes, do something. And can we talk her down with persuasion? Go ahead and make me reflex checks. Reflex. If you want to make me a persuasion check, Lucian, I need to know what you're going to tell her. What's a re is there what? Is there a reflex check? Oh, uh, oh, just the bun reflex. Wait, where is it? Hold on. Wait, where is the reflex check? Uh, I don't think there is a reflex can one. You just, yeah, uh, can you just roll your... Uh, it'll be... Yeah, it would just be athletics. Athletics. Alright, oh, well, I'm gonna do the, the persuasion check. Alright, I'm putting all of my luck points into this as well, so that's four luck points. Oh, <laughs> all of us got 18! Hell yeah, bro. <laughs> I'm trying, to, I'm trying to persuade her, bro. What, 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 do you, what do you say to her, camera head? Don't let yeah. this dick go to waste, fam. <laughs> bro! She, with one fluid motion, she takes a step back. I hate you so much, Nate. I am gonna shoot you in the head. Oh. Hear the sound of an overcoat flapping in the wind. But wait, wait, no. Wait, Tom, but even with a fucking... With a fucking 24 athletics, I wouldn't See be able to make it in time. At the last second, kind of dives over the ledge, and you grab oh. hold of the collar oh, yes. of that overcoat as she hangs right in front of that crowd who's all screaming and taking pictures of her. <clears throat> it's okay. You can get out of this. I'm sorry for what I said. You can you can come with us. You can live. I'm not letting you die. I'm sorry. <laughs> she looks up at you, and and there's like drones just surrounding you. As this is some great media footage. Pull her the fuck up right now. <laughs> and she just ignore she looks the up drones. At you, this is not. You're not a part of the media anymore. You're a person, and you can live. You have value. You can change your face. You can get out of all this. The helicopter is almost here. And all this pain, all this media coverage, everything would have been for nothing. You're just going to be another dead body on the news. And that's not what we came here for. We came here to get you out of here. So come on. I got it. Make me persuasion, please. Uh. God damn it. <sighs> damn it. <laughs> no. you, you, see, you see she looks up at you. With she with the stained eyes through her balaclava that she's still wearing, and she she kind of gives you a very weak smile. <sighs> Just pull her I, up. I'm sorry. And she she pulls pull out up. the knife that was handed no! to her no! and cuts <laughs> that part of the overcoat. And you see as all of the drones that are surrounding you just dive after her clouding her from view as you see the shape grow smaller and smaller as it falls from the top. <laughs> Nate, why did you say that to her? <laughs> Nate, you... Oh. oh my god. You just had to say it, huh, Nate? Okay, well... You see the helicopter, you know, still standing there. Okay. You see the drones have followed after her. You see the Twitch mod 
is just kind of sitting at the end of the rail, at the end of the, the edge of the ceiling, just kind of looking down, <laughs> watching as well. Oh. Okay, um, with my turn, um, he can't move, right? Or he, he's... No, we're, we're, kind of, we're kind of out of combat. If you want to shoot him, you I'm can. I'm going to push him off. Okay, you push. I'm not gonna make you roll for that. You just push him off, um, and then um, I say, "Let's get out of here." And then I look at Blue Tech and be like, "You are a dumbass, and you just cost us this job." You guys get in the helicopter, kind of quietly, as the helicopter takes off, going back to Jack Deacon Software Company, <laughs> over on the edge of town. He's it's gonna very. Be <laughs> there's. The sound of that infernal buzzing has left as there's nothing but the sound of the helicopter as the three of you sit in the back. Is there anything you want to say? Still beat, though. I'm, I'm just, like, sitting there with my hands and my, like, my face and my hands. Like, just shaking my head, like, <laughs> fuck! We Fucking didn't... shit! We didn't get paid. <laughs> we wasted we all didn't our money! Live. To light up a bunch of but drones, and kill a Twitch mod, and watch a girl commit suicide. <laughs> and and no money from it. Yeah. Most importantly, though, Deacon's gonna be disappointed. <laughs> oh, no. Jack, God, we spent, we spent four hours for nothing. For <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> literally nothing to show for it, besides probably. Probably Cole is a wanted man <laughs> for making this girl kill herself. Uh, a day later, you guys find yourselves back at Griffin headquarters. We should have made her pay in advance. 24 hours have passed. Camerahead, you're sitting in your personal room doing whatever it is you do, and you see a little notification come up on your laptop. Oh, okay. it's it's from Twitch. Oh? You click on it. What does or it do say? you click on it? Yeah, I click on it. I want to know what it you, says. You click on it. It says, congratulations. We like to hire you. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. Oh, and that's all we're end the session. Oh, my God. Oh, my oh God. shit. Silver lining. Oh, my God. That was so brutal. Job team, <laughs> you you successfully completed the side mission called the Ballad of Lily Rose. God damn. Was, was your whole ploy to get her to kill herself, Tom? It was an outcome that was possible. Nate, I am gonna <laughs> just, smack the oh, shit out of you, man. She would have got on that helicopter if you didn't say anything. Would she have though? Yeah, you would literally, Maybe. dude. You literally said, "Do you want to kill yourself or do you want to get out of here?" <laughs> You well, say I this too. Make the decision for herself. I know, but she's already in a position where she's stressed the fuck out, and I have to use all my luck points just to stop her from revealing her identity. I was like, yeah, I'm pretty sure her 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 decision was very close to being <laughs> kill herself right then and there. Oh dude. my god! I mean, I I thought she would be like, I thought it'd be this grandiose like, <laughs> I want to live, and we'd be like, all right, let's go. No, this and, is this no, is I cyberpunk, bro. Nothing's good is ever gonna happen. I hate that y'all don't watch One Piece, because that's literally part of One Piece. <laughs> when a crew oh. member grew up and to die her whole life. And he's like, you know what? I want you to say it. You gotta say it with your own mouth that you wanna live. I mean, <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying, like... No, I under... Is that I, un by the I way? understand where you're coming from, but at the same time, her emotional state was really, really bad. <laughs> so it probably was... Well, it could have gone... Either way, and also, I didn't. If somebody hadn't given her a knife, okay, okay, I didn't. Okay, well, okay, that's like that's like playing like three, like four D chess, all right? <laughs> like, <laughs> how, how am I supposed to? Okay. Like, uh, oh, what did she so, need a knife for? Well, no, because if we send her out on her own, and like people start like, I don't know, just in case, man. Uh, well, Walter. Are you, are, you gonna, are, are you interested in that contract with Twitch? Well, uh, seeing as we just bought off like a Twitch mod, I'd say very much no. 
Oh, you Wait, know, oh, man. Are you sure? They, they... No, dude, take it. What are you talking no, about? He's put... They're they're obviously like impressed with how badass you are. That'll get you a ton of money and like viewers. Yeah, but he's probably gonna have I, to fulfill I, I, the I, same I, contract that Lily had. I like I see that, but like seeing just how like miserable <laughs> they made Lily some life. Well, like you I, don't I, have I to suggest... sign the same contract. I would suggest at least reading the contract since it is kind of the reward for the mission. No. Oh, yeah, cool. read Walter. It, of course. Uh, you That's you the read only it. Thing came out of this mission. You know, you you see you see that that Twitch has a new opening since one of their recent streamers has has disappeared or sorry a wall, um, and they need new people to fill in the positions and they're really interested in what you've been doing. So if you sign the contract, you'll have access to a Twitch drone that at any point you can turn it on and stream to Twitch, and depending on how much you're streaming, you can earn revenue. Mm. Okay. That's actually not horrible. Do I have to sign it with blood, or like, can I just sign it? Sign it? What? Oh, nothing. I, I, signed, I signed the contract, I guess. Okay. Wait, I don't sign it yet. Is there any fine print? Um, just the normal legal stuff. Okay, cool. Nobody reached that anyway. I read it. I read it once. Remember when I tried to read it for Venmo and you oh, guys yeah, threw a yeah, fucking yeah. beer can at my head? No, <laughs> no one no, no one, no one reads the terms of service, bro. No, no logical person would ever read that. It's way too long. Especially for something that a lot of people use. Yeah. You go ahead and you type your credentials into the Twitch contract and pl press enter. And that is the end of the Ballad of Lily Rose. What a fucking sad Good end. Good job. Though. Good job, my ass. Oh. <laughs> I that is gonna be so disappointed. <laughs> oh god! I mean, to, to, to be perfectly honest, the, you know what? The blame goes to us for making a dumbass plan. Like it could have gone. We should have just. <laughs> yeah, we should have. We should have just taken her back to Griffin headquarters. Honestly, we just waited for a helicopter. Yeah, or just waited. We could have taken her anywhere that wasn't. I don't know the monument of the city. <laughs> 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 We're so dumb. Uh, <laughs> like, oh my god. Oh my god. I mean, you you know, it, seems so, it. it seems so logical thinking like all the way up to it. It was like, yeah, that sounds like a good plan. <laughs> and I was like, wait. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> thinking back on it, like. I feel like so the whole time weird. Tom was probably like, wow, their plan is actually horrible. <laughs> <laughs> and he just had to <laughs> you, guys, you guys actually did pretty well, in my opinion. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. We tried. The thing yeah, is, is like, it would have been so much easier with Deacon here. You know? But I, or with, uh. Yeah, Deacon so, wouldn't have. Yeah, that's wouldn't have us let us made this plan out, was We literally would have even had a better chance just staying at Cecilia's, mm -hmm. like, snake skin. Yeah. yeah. I yeah, bet you. We also probably would have, like. <sighs> We would have had a better chance of convincing her not to kill herself. <laughs> yeah. Well, you guys, you, know, you guys completed the side mission, so next time you go over to the board, there might be a new one available. Nice. nice. Cool. Hopefully, we'll have all four members of the group. <laughs> well, yeah. Matt. Although it is getting, it is getting pretty close to the time for the next main mission. Yeah, I mean, isn't yeah. it? it so is, what you guys want to do? It is. It was Wednesday, right? Like, what was the day? That... Yes. So wouldn't that... Yeah, oh, Jesus Christ. Wouldn't that mean, like, it's Thursday now, and that would be the day that we have to do the quest? It's oh, Thursday morning, okay. yeah. Uh, Cameron's checking his email. There was just the hugest lightning blast outside my room. Well, oh, wow. Uh, that, uh, that was the spirit of, that was the spirit of Lily Rose, bro. Coming out what? of my room. I said, well, I'm gonna assume that they're fireworks, but it more sounds like bullets. <laughs> um... <laughs> That's all I had for this session, so I think we're good for now.